Hey all you funky God-fearing gamers. I went out and looked for new music for my playlists. I found one song and this is it. <laughs> Granted, I only looked for like five minutes, so... That's as good as it's gonna get. Anyway, Animal Crossing. Get that out of here. It's time for Animal Crossing, it's still March. So I found out. I found out that the like villager thought bubbles don't appear like on Saturdays for some reason. Because I guess KK Slider counts as an event. And they don't do that on events. So it's not Saturday anymore. We don't, we're not going to play on Saturday as much. Hello there, everyone. My right name is Water. It's 2.32 p.m. on Thursday, March 3rd, 2022. Oh, someone recently asked me for, for advice. I thought it would be a good idea to share with everyone. They want to know what to do if they ever found someone passed out on the beach. I'll also find more of these guys if I, uh, by doing this. Just find more, like, Gullivers, Wisps. Uh, Sahara, the fox on the beach. Who else? Celeste? If that happens, speak to them and make sure they're okay. Do it several times if necessary. Be persistent. I like I like the idea that somebody found Gulliver washed up on the beach. Instead of doing anything, they went up to his bone and was like, Hey, what do I do? This person might be dead and I don't know what to do. Um, I need your advice, Isabel. Then offer it with, to help with anything they need. We must all, we all must do our part to keep this island safe. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. The weed goo has already hit. Balls, welcome, Hoggy. How's your night going? You enjoying some nice fine balls today? How, how are your balls in this fine evening? My balls are fine. I had some, uh, not egg rolls. They're not egg rolls. I didn't have egg rolls. They're, they're something else rolls. Dumplings, they're not dumplings. They're, they're like a cross between like a vegetable dumpling and an egg roll. I don't know what the fuck they're called. But, I had some of those. Sit up. Oh, that's penis backwards, dude. What? Take it from me, kiddo. The more you use a tool, the more it'll break in and fit your hands perfectly. Treat it almost like a plant that'll grow as you nourish it. Isn't that satisfying to fix things yourself? Sometimes they just break, though. Who is this from? Marlo? Ma Marlo, why are you just begging me? Okay, well, whatever. That's fine. <laughs> Thick Oh yeah, I have, to, I have to put in the, the Firefly Squid. Okay, so I do- I am coming into this with a plan today. So, there's this area up here. I moved Marlo away from it so I can hollow it out and make a little- I might make a little island up here. I'm gonna make like a little island in the river. It'll be really cute. That's my main idea for today. There's also a peacock butterfly dicking around somewhere on the island that I want to get to. Yeah, I've made so many people fall in love with that emote. I'm so glad. I'm glad to hear whenever someone comes in and tells me, hey, I've spread the good word of Thickerita. It just makes me so happy. They totally passed along that they love it. I'm so, that makes me so happy. It makes me, it makes me even happier because that's my art. <laughs> like, sure, it's my emote, but I also put so much blood and sweat and come into it. It just makes me so happy. Anyway, what kind of look should we go for today? Oh, I'm kind of thinking about the cinnamon, the cinnamon puffy blouse, maybe. Don't. It all really the hat really ties it all together. So, if I go with a good hat first, I could work with this crown that somebody gave me. Yeah, it looks kind of lame. Sombrero. I could do a sombrero. If you have blood in your cum, you may need to get that checked out. No, I've come in my blood, actually, all the way around. May still need to get that checked out, but it's less of an issue, I imagine. La Isla. I don't have a lot of cool clothes. I've only got, like, a lot of cute clothes, don't I? I could be this. I could be a fedora guy today. You know what? How about this? I'll be a fedora guy today. No, I won't. <laughs> Why do I even have that? Ooh, Halo. Yeah. I'll be fucking precious. How about that? It's not a problem. It just means you're transforming to come, man. What do you mean transforming into come, man? You, you telling me I'm not already come, man? I can get come here. That's awesome. Digivolve to come, man. Come, come on. Where'd that cinnamon roll blast go? It was just here. There it is. There we go. Can I keep pants? I do. Perfect. Glasses? 
I think the pink glasses still work for this. Oh, 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 oh. This song is kind of bad. I think the flip flops still work for me though. I don't know. I really like the. I really dig the flip flops. I need more colorful shoes. Like better shoes. That aren't just pink. Anyway, that's cute enough. Ugh. I need a. You need a milsery cum emote. All right, let's workshop this. Describe the mis the milsery cum emote. So obviously there's a milsery there, which is already pretty cummy on its own. Now in my mind, it's a picture of milsery, but then it says cum in big bold text over it. Now unfortunately that's not allowed, because you can't have an emote that has cum in the title, <laughs> which is genuinely so sad. But we can make it work. Bubloid. Oh! Hang on. I'm gonna put the bubbloid outside of uh, Lily's house. The bubbloid needs to go outside of Lily's house. I think once I'm done with making this my little island. Oh! Uh, once I'm done making my little shitty island, I should probably start working on giving these people some better yards. Maybe pave the landscape a little bit. There we go. I'll just pop this right here. Or I won't, I guess. Fuck myself. Cool. Go. Yeah. Oh, pink bubbles too. Are you kidding me? A hand grasped around it. A piece of wood. A hand grasped around a piece of wood with mostly coming out. A piece of wood, huh? As a substitute for cock? Hmm. I can make that work. Although I feel like there, there's something better than like a piece of wood that I can work with, you know? Nordic shelf. Oh, right, I bought this Nordic shelf for my weed room. I'll get to I'll get to Island Terraforming in a little in a little bit. First I gotta empty out my inventory. That's the priority in these games. You just gotta empty out your pockets as often as possible. Wait, wait, wait for what? If you have an idea, I don't have to wait. It's not like I'm making it right now. <laughs> now can we an alchemy moaning with a milsery coming out of his crotch. Like, fr fr from below, from the below the emote cutoff. Done. That way you have both an alchemy and a milsery. Now, emotes are like 56 pixels tall and wide. So, I can make a bigger version of it, but it might look a little bit crusty when it gets small. So, it did, maybe. Cock, sucker. It might be a little bit difficult, but Milster would definitely fit at least partially into an emote. I think I was supposed to customize this. Yeah, I have to take this to the to the island to customize it. Alchemy's pretty cute, though. You know, actually, instead of trying to cram two Pokemon into one emote, it could be like a two emote kind of thing. Where, like, the Mosery is just shooting out of the corner. It's just shooting out of the corner with, like, energy behind it. Uh, and you can pair that with another emote. Like, um... Like Tingle. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, t like Tingle Moan. Or any, or any other Gasm-style emote that some people may or may not have. There's plenty of Gasms. That'll work. <laughs> it could be a two-parter. That's a good idea, Hoggy. That's a good idea. I should probably write that down somewhere. So I don't forget. That's okay. Sometimes watch these VODs over to look for clips. Maybe I'll remember then. Maybe I won't. We'll see. So, of course, this is not a Saturday. As I was mentioning earlier. You don't get thought bubbles from characters on Saturdays because that's an event for some reason. So there's going to be a lot less of people thinking on Saturdays. And this is what's Wednesday. Oh, there you are. I, um, want to talk to you about something. I was watching this movie all about going to new places, meeting new folks, and learning new stuff. I have the world, the whole world to see. Maybe if I went to a new place, I can meet new bugs, eat new snacks, and learn to be really cool. Fuck you, no? You have to give me your picture first, dude. Huh? You think I shouldn't go? Well, I guess it'd be pretty lonely if I left, huh? 
All right, if you want me to stay, then I'll stay. Let's get our snack times going. Good. He stays. I'll kick the bunny out whenever he gives me his photograph. Which will be a little while. It'll be a bit. Ooh, shooting star. Oh, yeah, I forgot I got some shooting stars last time I played this. That kicks ass. Don't know if I was on stream or off stream. Also, I keep on dripping a little bit. I have no idea why. Like, that just started happening. But, so that's gonna be a fucking thing. I guess. I guess I'm dying. Anyway. We're going to Harvest Island so I can paint this shitty shelf. Get my fortune told. Look at art. Yep, that's the one. That's the plan. Okay, yeah, going forward, I might not do Saturdays as much. I'll probably do this Saturdays off stream. I think I talked about this last time. I'll probably do the Saturdays off stream. Most most of them, at least. And I'll probably just play the game day by day by day. Not really trying to skip any. Unless there's something coming up. At least until I've got all the bugs and fish that I can't have in the month. In which I'll just skip to any reasonable events. Like like uh, Sasha and uh, Julian's birthday are this month. And then when those are over, we'll just, we'll just move on to April. There's not a whole lot going on in March, it turns out. <laughs> Pretend that's not a salt shaker. <laughs> okay, but what, what? Wouldn't it be awful to come salt? <laughs> it's a, you know those like big salt containers like of the kosher salt and you like, you, you open up the one side that like just lets it pour the fuck out, just Imagine that every single time. <laughs> That's what that's what Tingle has to go through every single day. That's what Tingle has to go through at least a couple times a day. Cause he's addicted to masturbating. <laughs> it would hurt so bad. It'd be so noisy. <laughs> hey, wait, did I uh, did I ask for the wrong thing? I see an island whose residents prefer intents. Prefer living in tents to owning their own homes. Oh, no, no, I just changed my photo last time. I was so used to the uh, my old photo that I forgot that I took a shrimp pic. The president of Nook Inc. is more than a little bewildered by this turn of events. From this vision, I deduce that your luck with money will diminish. Oh. Oh, hey, Harriet. Oh, bye, Harriet. Tingle was the kid that jocked off in the back of the class. Oh, he's jocking off. I, tink, yeah. Tingle is a bit of a freak. Tingle's a bit of a freak. Take my money. Take my money, please! <laughs> you w You lied he wasn't a kid then? True. He was never a kid. He's just always been an, or an old- an old freaky man. A mid-30s man who thinks he's a fairy. Man, wouldn't it be crazy if he was a fairy? Would it be fucked up? Cool, thanks. Chalked off in the back of the classroom as an adult. That's worse. <laughs> that's worse, Hoggy. That's a, that's a sweat frog. Ooh, oh, I think I already have this. And this is the milk painting, right? This is the painting that, like, if, you sh if she's pouring a whole lot of milk, it's fake. I think I've already got the quaint painting though, right? That's only a little bit of milk. That's only a little bit of cum pouring out of that. I, f I know I've seen one of those before. Let me check my notes. Do what, did I actually get the quaint painting or did I not? I did. And what was this other statue over here? <laughs> That's why he was in jail in Wind Waker. <laughs> oh, dude, Wind Waker. <laughs> Valiant statue, do I have this? I think I do. Yeah, I do. Cock! Well, I guess I'll buy one anyway. There was not to. You know? Also, I'm using my Joy-Cons again because <laughs> I forgot to charge my controller since last week. I tried turning it on before the stream and I was like, oh yeah! I never plugged that in, did I? I should really play Wind Wanker. All I know is the, like, the broad strokes of Wind Wanker and uh, Tingle being in jail, but that's about it. Hey, you! That is squid! You were looking to get something customized! I am. Alright, leave it to me! So, what's your order? 
Uh, it's a, it's a, it's one of these. It's an order shelf. Make it black. Make it black. Yeah. Fabric? You don't need any fabric, do you? Maybe like. Maybe like a maybe like a little bit of fabric. Leaves, leaves or little flowers, butterflies. Probably leaves, right? Yeah. You got a wind winker. <laughs> I've got. <laughs> Hoggy. I should probably get that on the Wii. I see. I want to play the Wii U HD version because I know that there's like a speed sale in that that makes it a whole lot faster. But my Wii U gamepad doesn't hold a charge anymore. Like, I, it'll stay plugged in for as long as you, as, as you want. And then you'll unplug it and it'll start dying within like 10, 20 minutes. It's just, it's so sad seeing that thing die. It's like well, watching a relative that you love go into uh, like dementia. It's just, it's just not fully there anymore. It's so sad because you used to play hours in that thing. Seeing my Wii U die is just so depressing. <laughs> I might have to buy a new gamepad, which probably wouldn't be too expensive, given, you know, everything. Probably won't be too expensive. I got a copy of Wind Waker for the GameCube and, and a working GameCube. <laughs> You'll just let me borrow it. Well, I've also got a GameCube. But, um, if I was going to play the GameCube version, I'd probably just play it on, uh, Dolphin. Oh, look! The sand is finally the right color to match the, the fucking sand castle! I thought it would never happen! That's cute. Yeah, I'd probably just play it on Dolphin if I wanted to play the GameCube version. I'm sure there's a way to emulate a Wii U, but eh. Dive for sea creatures, talk to neighbors, visit the Bruce, catch a carp. Cool. Nah. I'll probably just buy another Wii U gamepad. I'll pick it up. I'll pick up the game off of eBay or something. It's probably decently cheap by now. And then I'll have that for my shelf. For my Reddit shelf. You know? Or I just won't do that. Or I'll just play the worst version of it. I'm sure nobody would mind if I played the worst the, the worst version of Wind Waker and then complain the entire time. Sure, sure, surely nobody would mind me whining about playing the worst version of a game. Procolo? Procolo, what are you doing looking so cute? Hey there! What's up? What's new, dude? I wonder if something fun will happen today. It could, any old second, any time now. I'm so excited. We'll come back to him later. I gotta give him a gift. Julian, I'll come back to you later. I gotta get him a gift. Star fragments. Should probably go get the rest of those star fragments and seashells off the ground before I go to the beat, before I go to the shop. I just claimed my 28th victim. I think off stream he was talking about the car crash again, which really upset me. Yeah, like, like off stream a couple weeks ago, I started talking to him for, for some reason and he started talking about the car wreck again. I was like, damn it, I wish I got this on stream again. But oh well. We'll get around to him. I wonder if I should like redesign his house at all. I do have the option to like fully redesign my oh Annalise to like redesign my uh, my friends' houses. Why not? I love my thirsty little flowers. They make me so happy. You see, I'm glad I finally got into flower breeding eventually. All right, what do you want? Well, hello there, Nip. Nippy. What's the latest? I don't know if you're so invigorating. Saying it's not okay, it would be so terrible waste. That's it? That's all you gotta say? Oh, hey, look. Race car bed? Ooh, he would love a race car bed, wouldn't he? Although, the race car bed would remind him. He would give, he's like, he's had the taste of blood before. You know how animals are. Once they've gotten that taste for blood, they're not really gonna, they're not really gonna come down from that. So, it might just remind him of, of uh, an old passion of his. Murder. Ooh! Missed it in a bottle. What do we got? It's a... Brown herringbone wall. Alright, that's the thing, I guess. 
When should I go dive into the sea? Oh yeah, I forgot about this asshole. Can I water him? Get him wet, get him wet, get him wet. Ah! No, you want the flank I have. You're so smart. Oh. Can I get him wet? Nope. Hang on. Um, no, I don't want to be some climbing just besides the rocket. Okay. Nope. I'm trying to water him. Wait, go check his blood pressure. Who's your provider? Get him wet. Yeah. Yeah. I know you can whack him with your net. Whoop. The waves, the waves are gone. The pool noodles are the last time's a common place to send lads to to stop or tough to put stern to stern. He's really just out of it, isn't he? Wake up! <laughs> up there we go. Took a little bit. By the way, we were late to the doom sands. It's not up! What? Who? Where? Not throwing why and why? When and why? That's the charge. You there! What's at the rude awakening, huh? Don't you know who you're dealing with? Oh, it's you, Jin. That's different then. I'm slightly less annoyed. Hmm? What was that very stuff about? Not sure. I think I heard a fish say it once. I love Gulliver. Anyway, I guess I must have fallen overboard and washed up on this beach. It happens. Don't worry about me. Getting rescued is gonna be a breeze. I'll cough it up using my handy dandy. Uh, uh, and, uh, and all the dialogue repeats from here. This isn't handy or dandy. Ah, oh, something's all cracked and busted. Yeah. I like his unique dialogues a lot, but then it gets repetitive. And he's got a lot of text boxes. And that was this. That was a Super Mario and Luigi reference. I haven't met someone since watching up on all Coral Cola. That is a Mario and Luigi for this Game Boy reference. Did you get that one, gamers? Hey, gamers. It's me. Your buddy, Tinnigan Doodles. Just want to make sure you got that reference. I do love doing the doing these little side quests, though. Just every day, someone shows up and it's like, I would like you to do this for me. And I'm like, yes, please. I would, I would gladly do that for you. Especially because I have to do this 30 times for Gulliver. Motherfucker. 30 times. Did I build a bridge to go over here yet? I have not. Well, now I have something to do later. I'll just plop the bridge right there. I'll put a bridge there. It'll be beautiful. It'll be cute. Oop. And here I thought I was about to get away from the clams. I was about to mention how I never need to dig up clams anymore ever again. That's not true. That's not true. Dug up a communicator part. You see, I really want to get that big, big robot that you can get. But you have to craft it with, like, communicator parts. And, like, wisp soles. And your left leg. It costs so much. Why? Why the manila clam? It costs so much of my time and energy. Hey, doesn't March also mean that thunderstorms can happen now in Animal Crossing? Because if so, that kicks ass. I want to see a thunderstorm. I'm pissed that I haven't seen a, a thunderstorm around here in forever. A couple years ago, it used to thunder all the time. Is that all of them? Nope. The storm smell is just too good to pass up on. And sure, I may not be able to smell an Animal Crossing, but I can at least look at the thunder and hear it, which is pretty cool. Hey, you. Hey, did you find them? I did. I did find them. There you go. Give me something good. Okay, a little two-step. The pigs are coming back in there. Let's see if I can send this the message. Oh, you cruise me, your brother, and from another order. <laughs> So that's what happened again. Can this thing might pick me up? That's him whispering. <laughs> he whispers louder than he talks. You're the best. Thanks for all the help. I promise to return the favor. Be sure to check him out in a few days. I'm going to send you something that I'll knock your flippers off. Just to make sure you put on some flippers on before you open it, okay? 
I'm safe. Nothing to do now but pace back and forth for the next few hours. Better get started. I love him. I love him. He's my favorite. Oh, hey, Marlo's home. I moved Marlo's house over here while I'm temporarily renovating the river. That's fine. I don't, I don't think he'll mind living over here. In fact, I could. I might as well just move someone's house down here. If I move, like, Brocolo's house over here, Coach and Sasha could have more room to live, I think. Like, I, I could give them a, a nice yard, you know? Did the tasty scent bring you here? Don't be shy. Fill up those nostrils. There's enough smells for everyone. Okay. Marlo. Oh, this. Ain't nothing fancy. It's my fav- It's been a favorite of mine for ages. Veg some veggie quiche. You can have the recipe. I've made this for myself. So many times I could do with my eyes closed. Give me! Thank you. I think I've already got this recipe also. That look. You have, me you have memories too, don't you? Don't ask me how I know, but I know. Give me! I've given out the recipe near a million times over the years. Okay, great. Now I've got an extra recipe to hold on to, I guess. That's fine. I'll put it outside my shop. Because someone came by the other day and snagged on my recipes, so... I haven't had to, like, restock those in, in ages. Hey, Bricola, how'd you get over here? He's moved so far from his home. Yeah, I could probably move someone's house over here. Oh, hey, Tabby. Come on, fishing rod. Do your job. You haven't caught anything. Okay. <laughs> I like the little side eye she gave me afterwards. I right, pop this here. Veggie key. I should probably donate the firefly squid before. What the fuck was that? Oh, it was these guys. I should probably donate the firefly squid before I forget about it and sell it by accident, like an asshole. Probably. What kind of star fragments are the big blue ones? Pisces fragments? How many Pisces fragments do I have? Three. Wow, that's a lot of Pisces fragments. I could probably make the Pisces table if I got the recipe for it. Pisces. Do I have the Pisces table recipe? Let me find out. If not, I'll have to stream this on a late day or something to try and find uh, Celeste. Well, I definitely haven't made the Pisces t thing yet, so... No, but I... Oh, I got the Pisces lamp. Oh, I thought it was... I'm thinking about cancer. I was thinking about the crab table. I can make the Pisces t lamp if I want to. Sweet! Pissy fresh. Able sisters. Do you have anything cute that I can put on? Like maybe some fake wings or something? For my little angel outfit. Ooh, but you have, that, you have the goth dress. That kicks ass. Hang on, I gotta get that goth dress on. What's better than a halo in a goth dress? Come on. It's my Sims couture. Let's see here. Yeah. It's good. Ooh. Cyber shades? Wow, these look awful. Those are genuinely bad. Nice. Oh, hang on. Mage's boots. I wish those were the same shade as pur of purple. But they just aren't. I'm mage now? I mean, I could be... I could be a mage if I wanted to. With a halo. You know what? I think I look good. I think I'm cute. I like it. Thanks, Mabel. Thanks, Mabel. Hey, you. You're the one I want to talk to. You know the tapestry hanging on the left wall over there? It belonged to our mother. Every time I look at it, I get this warm feeling inside. Like when she would hug me. I think she's done giving me recipes. She's done giving me unique patterns, unfortunately. Aww. That means she's not gonna give, give me patterns anymore, which means there's no reason to talk to her ever again. I don't think. Unless she wants to give me more family lore, I don't think there's any reason to talk to her ever again. I'm surprised, like, talking to Mabel isn't a Nook mile reward, honestly. Like, go be friends with Mabel. I'll give you money for it. <laughs> I'll give you- I'll give you Nook Mao's incentives for making friends with her. She's desperately lonely, needs friends. 
I'll pay you for it. I'll make it worth your while. Whoa! A man! I want the man, please. Seems interested in the man. He's gonna go perfect on the nude beach. I just bought a man. <laughs> okay. Now, who was expecting to walk in here and see a man on the table? Like, let's be honest. I think that caught everybody by surprise. Timmy and Tommy were, uh, were surprisingly chill about the whole thing, actually. Yeah, take all these. All these seashells. Isn't there a Nook Miles achievement for just buying a shit ton of items and spending so much money? So much money. So much money. Like, actually, so much cash. Bell ringer. Five million bells. Spend five million bells. Okay, yep. I just have to buy everything in here. All right. Why, is, why did he shiver? Why, why is he shuddering? Did I scare him? Antique console table? It's a pretty cute looking table, actually. It's expensive as hell, but it's good looking. Can I give this to... I don't know. Lily? Lily it, it seems pretty Lily chic. You know? Is this a backup generator? Outdoor generator. I bet you somebody would like the outdoor generator. Somebody would like the outdoor generator. Somebody. Who though? Or I could just put it outside of their house. You know what? Chatter. I think Chatter should get it. I think I should just put it outside of Chatter's house just to make it a little bit uglier. Soup kettle. Soup kettle. Is the soup kettle cute? Is it like just a pot of soup on a, on a, on a stove? Or is it just the kettle? Soup kettle. Oh, it's an instant pot. Yeah, okay. I'll give that to Piccolo. He'll love that. He loves soup. Oh, this dude loves soup. Whiteboard. Nice. Nice. Here's what I'll do. I'll just pop this right outside of Chatter's house. That's a bad sound. But you do get this now. Yo, good to see you from a gay. <laughs> we meet again. Or did I did that first meeting happen in a dream this morning? Oh, okay. I want to turn this off because it's the worst sound in the world. That's actually the, the most awful sound. I would have given that to Tom. That would have been a good Tom gift, but now I'm just going to sell that shit. Whoa, oh, we meet again. Yep, here you go. It's a... It's that toilet that was outside of your house. Where'd it go? Nope, that's not it. Where'd the fucking toilet go? Tankless toilet, that's right. He'll love this. It can't be, can it? A tankless toilet? You, did, you could just feel the quality in this thing. <laughs> I wish that everything was made out of whatever this is made out of. Porcelain? I know exactly where I'm going to put this. You should come to the soft launch of my house rebrand and check it out. You know, I can't just accept this without giving you something in return. Let's see. How would you feel about a rainbow sweater? I just, I've already got one, man. It's alright, I guess. Woo! That'd make a good gift for Julian, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll give that to Julian. It'll be like a, uh, an, a beacon of I'm gay. Or he'll look ugly in it, one or two. It'll look good, or it will look horribly bad. There's no in between. And I'm ready to take that risk. I'm okay with that. Pretty sure I'll find more seashells, like, along my beach as the day goes along, so I have to keep on checking in. Lily, would you like a rattan stool, or is that too ugly for your house? It might actually be too ugly for her house. Uh, no, it'll work. Not the right color, though. Which is unfortunate. Her entire house could really do use a redo. Like, this wooden partition is ugly as hell. Uh, this mini fridge. Get yourself an actual fridge, girl. This froggy chair is the wrong color. I think I gave that one to her, though. 
her bathtub is right next to the door. Like, flip those around, dude. Just, like, take everything that's over here and move it over there. Swap it around. And this little table, this little chair makes no sense either. I want to give her something, but she won't let me. I helped you stop by, Toadie. What's up? Oh, that reminds me. I had the crazy dream last night, and you were dead, Shin. You and I were about to embark on a wooden trip, or were we on a boat? Is this the second dream she's had about us? I've completely forgotten. Isn't it funny about how the memory of a dream can just vanish in an instant? I'm going to walk out and walk back in, and you're not going to be sitting in that chair, okay? So I can give you a stool for you to sit on. Actually, the rattan stool might actually look pretty good in that corner. If it were just like a different color, though. Here I come, Lily. Lily. Don't you do it, you motherfucker. She's got two chairs to sit in. It's going to be so hard. It's going to be so difficult to get her to not sit. How come, how come there's always a character that just loves to sit the moment you go into their house? Procolo's got just as so many chairs and he doesn't sit all the time, I don't think. She's going for it. Look, she's going for it. Look, she's going for it. Nope. I hope you stop by, Tony. Here's a gift. It's a, it's a chair. Please, please replace one of your other chairs with this. Where is it? Where'd it go? Or Tom's still. There it is. Stool? You want we really we want to give this to me? I do. Thank you so much. I've been hoping for something like this. I've been oh. It's always the same dialogue though, which is getting a little bit unfortunate. Retro sweater though, that's kind of nice. Give me a chore. What's on your mind, Tony? Give me a chore to do. I love writing tools. Just working at them on my shelf in the store gets me dreaming up things to write. The latest writing tools come with all kinds of features, so there's bound to be one just for about anyone. Writing tools? Like pe mechanical pencils? For me, there was that one special pencil, and the one that made me care about what I used to write with. What? The softness of the graphite in that pencil made writing feel so good, Tony. It was inspiring. Oh, I didn't know she knew how to write. Didn't know she could read either doesn't look like a reader though she did have reading glasses and a book on her so i guess she's a little bit of a fucking nerd i guess it's back here of course of course now i think i want to give this antique console to tabby i know her house is a little bit shabby but i can fix her i can fix her i can give her a, a better house all right, to get rocks. Eventually, whenever I make my way down to town hall, I'll get myself a bridge too. Don't forget. And think about the bridge. I shouldn't forget the bridge. Whenever I get around there. The bridge, the donating, the amiibos. Ooh, I could also check my online shopping too, couldn't I? Now that I have got, got the app, I keep on forgetting that I have that little online shopping app. Yeah. See, even if we're not doing, like, uh, KK Slider concerts, we could still get some some songs. Lower light. Oh, shit, that's kind of nifty. Yeah, give me... Nope, never mind. Fuck myself. I think I've got Kumi. KK Kumi. Pie. Blossom Lantern. Uh, actually, I wanted to give some more posters to people. Anyone want posters? I'll buy some posters for you. Send it right to you. Camo frog. See, I'm just going to give all the frog posters to Yingy. Because I know she appreciates that and it gets me some bonus points with the, uh, with the, with the Nook Miles. Birthday cake card. Probably change my... Probably, should probably change this so it's not a prank anymore. Chin. And then for the fuck of it, I'll just do apostrophe dabs. Now, is it the, the the dabs you do with your arms, or is it like the weed dab? That's for you to decide. Probably not the weed dab, because that hurts. Mm, grabs you. Costs a thousand bells to send. How, much, how broke am I? Oh, yeah, the internet. You're good. Ugh. Sending item. 
It's a shame you can't organize by species. You have to scroll through it slowly. To find the right frogs. Eventually, I'm going to forget which frogs I have and have in center. Ah, Cousteau! They like Cousteau. They have to. Why keep on sending people gifts? It's very nice. Gets me letters sent. And other people get things. It just costs me a little bit of money. Although, keep I keep on forgetting that I need to buy some more of these cinnamon roll stuffs. All this Hello Kitty garbage. Did I buy all of my Melody stuff already? I think I bought some of it, but I don't know. I'd have to check my handy dandy catalog. Unfortunate, but I have to do this. So, Cinemural. I think this is organized by alphabet. So, Cinemural should be right around here. Did I get the, the rug at all? I don't think I ever bought the rug. Unless it's in rugs. Oh, it's probably in rugs. They're not, they're not even all in the same thing. Some real wall. City cape. No rugs, huh? I never bought the rug. Okay, well, at least now I know where I, I left off on. Get the rug. My melody bed. I think I bought the bed. Don't think I ever bought the chair, though. And whenever I have all these, I can give some... Oop. Get the clock. I'll get the clock again. Whenever I ever have all these, I'll, I can make some houses for the cinema, uh, for the My Melody characters. That's the one. Sanrio. That's the one. The hood. The hood is precious. Oh shit, money! Hey! Maybe I could have. <laughs> maybe I could have afforded, afforded that. I absolutely could have afforded that fucking. Big gateway now. Oh well. Hopefully I'll have enough stone to make those spike pits finally. It's hard to get enough rocks for a spike pit. The problem is it's just one spike pit also. I got to make like four or five of those. I'll make that spike pit eventually though. Mark my words. Mark apply my words, I will have that spike pit. Eventually. There's gonna be no chance of anyone ever falling on it or maybe even seeing it, but hey. It, it can be there. And we know. You and me. We know the spike pit is there. I could also put a sign that says warning spike pits. I should probably make a sign that says warning spike pit. But I don't have a signpost yet. I'm surprised I still haven't gotten the signpost recipe. Despite how many recipes I've found from random people or on the shores of beaches. Haven't, haven't gotten the signpost recipe. It's genuinely so sad. I think the day that I stop decorating this island will be the day that, like, I run to one side of the island and it takes a second to load the furniture. Like that. Seeing islands that have so much shit on them that, like, it takes a second to load all the stuff. That's painful to me. I never want my island to be like that. Oh, Julian, where are you going? You going home? Oh, Julian's going home. Why is, why is Julian going home? I've never seen someone go home before, I don't think. Knock, knock, babe. I'm coming in. Maybe Cola went home, too. Maybe they like swapping around. Welcome to my humble castle. Chateau Julian. Uh, I got you a rainbow sweater. Because you're gay. Let's see here. Nope, there. Ah, oh, fuck. I gave him the retro. Uh, is it going to look good? Oh my gosh. Is this really a retro sweater? Is this the only kind of gift that I've got to try on right away? <coughs> oh, it's, it's bad in a good way. Hey, not bad. Really not bad at all. Dare I say good? I can't let you walk away empty handed when you were so generous to me. Here, you gotta take my sleeveless tunic, okay? Sleeveless tunic? Okay. Let me check out this tunic. Uh, mm, mm, ah, actually, that's kind of alright. I think I like it. 
What do you got in here? Yep, that's where I keep all my designer clothes, my trusty Gemini closet. Trends can change on a dime, so you gotta be ready to pull out the fresh look at a moment's notice. That's right. That's why I'm always changing my clothes. It's a... Uh... <laughs> He's got his maid dress in here. I see. I guess that makes sense. Oh, whoa, I should give Sasha one of those. Looking for a rap session with old Julian, eh? Feast your eyes on my retro sweater. I'm pulling it off, right? Or should I literally pull it off and try again? I just gave that to you, man. Don't be mean. Don't be mean. I just get. Uh, you ready to hear some classic Julian drama? All right, buckle up, Chin. Oh, good. I was going to buy some flowers for a friend, but I didn't want to send them with the wrong impression, you know? The wrong color or arrangement could be disastrous. It could literally change the course of our friendship. Or not. They're just flowers, right? <laughs> Sometimes I just need to say it out loud to check myself. Okay. He doubted himself for a second. Now, change relationship how? Maybe to coach? Maybe he was giving them the coach. I gotta run back to my house, pull all these star fragments away, because I really don't need them on right now. And uh, grab... Grab that one of those maid dresses. I've got a load of extra maid dresses. I'll give one of those to, uh, to Sasha. How's that sound? Dude's playing fucking Minecraft, baby, from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Fucking Minecraft, baby. All right, let's see here. Get this out of here. Star fragments. If you fragmented a star, wouldn't it be fucked up? Wouldn't that break a lot of things? Wouldn't that get us both in trouble? Stone. Clay. Metal. Should probably check and see if I have enough stones for it. the spike pit yet. Or part of the spike pit, rather. Am I keeping any of these things? Soup kettle, I'm giving that to Brocolo. Nordic shelf, I'm gonna pop that in the back room over here. Cause it'll look good. Oh yeah, the chandelier from uh, Boulder Dash? Boulder Dash. That's the one. You know, I think this weed room is pretty alright. I think it's pretty alright, though. There's a couple of things I would like to move. I want to move this. There we go. It feels just a lot more stable on that shelf there. Can I put this up here? I can. Put this over here. The mini fridge can stay over here, I think. Uh... What else would look good on this shelf back here? Is there anything at all that would look good over here? Actually, you know what I could do? I could grab these. Just move them over here. Grab the record box. Put that in the corner. Pick all this up and stick it there. That's pretty alright. That's decent. That's decent. Although, this fucker's gotta move. Get over here. Up on top of the shrimp. There you go. Oh, yeah, and the gyros can also, like, stick out of the shelf quite nicely, can't they? Yeah! Oh, hang on. Can I make him look like he's sitting on top of the, uh, the mini fridge? I can't. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, I think I did good here. The Nordic shelf pulls it all together. Yeah! Unless. <laughs> Unless. Let me, just, let me just check my stuff first. I could get a coat rack in here. I could. I could get a coat rack in here. For what purpose? Man. Palm tree lamp. Let's let's pull the palm tree out for a second and consider it. Let's just like pull this out for a second and think about this this uh, this palm tree lamp. Just for a minute. Hmm. If you also want here, I got bonsai trees? Yo! How many bonsai trees do I need to make that other bonsai tree? There's like a big bonsai tree you can make that requires several smaller bonsai trees. Put a T-Rex in here. That'd be kind of sick. That'd be kind of rad. 
Golden Dung Beetle. No. Who needs the Golden Dung Beetle? Alright, cool. Here's what I'll do. Is this palm tree lamp gonna look good? Or is it... Uh, all right, there's nothing. It's a big, it's a big boy, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's a big boy. Ah, uh, okay. I mean, if I could just like, no, no, it's a bad move. I did just chuck a fucking lava lamp into the bin into the bin, so that's cool. And this corner will just stay empty for now. Until I can put something cool there, like a rubber scorpion or something. That's it. I feel really bad about having an empty corner, but eh, it's just necessary. Unless I find like a cool plant somewhere. Maybe we can find like a nice weed bush. Nice weed bush. Cool. There was something else I was gonna pull out. What was it? Maid dress. That's the one. I was gonna give one of these to Sasha. Now, which dress? Oh, I've only got one of these left. I've only got one regular maid dress left. So that's unfortunate. Uh, the full length maid gown will probably look this about the same one. It'll look probably about the same. Whiteboard. Mannequin. I'm probably not gonna use the whiteboard for anything. I might be able to sell it. Might be able to sell it, maybe. But other than that, whiteboard, eh, doesn't really have much of a purpose. Maybe Marlo. Probably not. Probably not. That'd be an ugly gift. Let's grab some of these for later. For Pietro and the rest of them. Nah, uh, there's four, four fossils in the max per day, right? Let's go to the museum. Go to the museum, turn on my firefly. Oh, what, what are you thinking about, Pietro? Oh man, you know that feeling after you stay up all night talking with friends and then it gets quiet? You just want to keep talking and hanging out? Unrelated. What are you doing right now? Can I come over? Uh, uh sure, sure. But you have to bring the grass. All right, and away we go, straight to the house of Chen. Oh, look, we're just going right, right now. All right, all right. I didn't really clean up or anything, but sure. Uh, 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 oh. I want to show off my house to him. Ahem. Well, here we are. There we go. Oh, I almost forgot I brought a little something for you. It, ooh, furniture. That's new. Pietro's photo. Enjoy. I can kill him right now. But do I dare? He, he's so integral to the island. I've got an emo with him on it. This is the perfect time to play a game. Are you interested? Yeah. The game is high card, low card. Cool. If you guessed right, I'll give you a short sleeved uniform top. Let the games begin, Hong Kong. I'll draw the first card. Okay. I'll kick him out if he chooses to leave. If I ever catch him thinking about life and such, and he's like, I want to move out. I don't want to be here anymore. I'll let him, I'll let him go. We've got the number seven. So the big question is, will the number on the next card be higher or lower than seven? That really is the question, isn't it? The card is in hand. Now, is the number on the card higher or lower than the original seven I drew? Lower. It's five. You win. What do I win? Short sleeve uniform top. Oh. Oh. Kind of lame. Hey, talk about my fucking decor. Talk about my gaming hot tub. So you're using a gaming desk as a desk. Very cool. <laughs> With a desk like this, a screenplay practically writes itself. A literal screenplay. Open on a brooding, yet undeniably handsome sheep staring out the great unknown. Nico, welcome. Pietro just gave me his photo, and now I kind of want to, like, slaughter him, but... I think he's too perfect for the... Oh. He's gonna go sit in my table. Oh my! Is he gonna sit in my chair? <laughs> Please sit down. Ah, oh, asshole. But um, I don't think I'm gonna kick him out. I think I'll just wait for him to like think about life and such, and then I'll be like, hey, if he wants to leave, I'll let him leave. You just got off work and you're walking home. Oh, did you have fun? 
Wow, I'm all about your Macrom tapestry here. You really know how to decorate. Oh, wanna, de wanna decorate the set for my Bossa Nova music video? There's no pay, but you get to listen to me limp sync. Hey, do you want to come over here and compliment my shrimp? I know you do. Yeah, here he comes. Oh, hang on. Ah, fuck. I gotta... I gotta stop him. I gotta shit step. Wait, Pietro, over here by the shrimp. Eh. There we go. Shrimp. Yeah! I'm getting a real deep sea vibe from your sweet shrimp. Yeah! I can't imagine diving down to find one of those myself. So it's cool that I can come here and check it out. That's sweet. I never thought about that. I never thought about them, like, diving. I'm the only one who really does that, isn't it? Aren't I? I could give them deep sea critters as good gifts. Over here, Pietro. I love showing off my stuff to Pietro. I've got an emote with Pietro on it. So it'll be easier to kick him out whenever he's ready to leave on his own. This room still needs some work. It's a, it's a work in progress. Oh, you're just gonna sit on the ground, though. With a book. So, is the rest of your place as hype as this? You gotta give me the grand tour! Yeah, he's ready to leave. He's in the fish room and he's like, alright, I've seen... I've seen this, but better at the museum. For free. Yeah, hang on, what's the point of having a fish room when there's a museum? That's... I have to redo that entire room. This is my meth basement, Pietro. You like it? Oh, I'm glad to see you're getting plenty of use out of your beaker. I buy way too many gadgets that I never use or even unbox. I just like buying stuff, Hong Kong. I love the rap battle going on over here constantly. This makes me so happy. Anyway. I like how I just walked over to the chemistry lab. The, ch the chemistry set. Just to check it out. You don't need to look at that, Pietro. Don't pull out your phone or any take any pictures, please. This is my favorite room, Pietro. Observe my cutie pie room. This is my cutie pie chamber. Go look around. This is where I will come to be adorable. Ah, you, I see you've chosen the froggy chair. A wise choice. Oh. I can get pretty comfortable in a place like this. So, when can I move in? It'd be really cool if you could have roommates in this game. Honestly. Like, you take your bestie and, like, move them in. And then you could like pretend like you're married or something. Some people would like that. Hold on, are you trying to sneak out of your own party? No? I thought you were abandoning me for a second there. Oh. Okay. I guess I just have to hang out with him until he's ready to leave. Well, what'd you think of my house, dude? My eyes were immediately drawn to your mermaid vanity. In fact, I'm picking up some serious oceanic vibes in here. Is that intentional, honk honk? I read that as, um... What did I read that as? I think I read it as cocaine. Either way, next time I'm cast in an underwater action thriller, I'm totally running lines here. I guess I'm just hanging out with Pietro until he's ready to leave. You know, yeah, a lot of this room really is just, like, shit that I picked up and enjoyed. Like that bass in the wall. I'll go first person. You see, one day... One day I'm gonna make this into its own room. Probably, like, a little shitty streamer room over there. But then this corner will be empty. It's so, it's so sad. I think I'm gonna put Pietro right up there. But other than that, I think this room's pretty alright. I might just take the entire fish chamber and make it into like its own kitchen. Cause I like making kitchens. Nope, looks like he's ready to leave. Well, I should probably hit the road, honk honk. Alright, bye. Bye. Thanks for the memories. No problem, Pietro. Although at the same time, now I never have to give him another gift ever again. So that makes me happy. Knowing that seeing Pietro is not a requirement. What is uh where does this thing go? There it is. Nope. There it is. 
perfect. Perfect. Where's the, uh... I just had it. I just threw it away. The dynamic photo. That's the one. That's the one. I have to turn this into a museum. I don't know if I have it or not, but... He'll take it. Maybe. He might take it. I hope he takes it. Don't have this motherly statue in my pocket because he already has one, actually. I think I tried to give him the motherly statue last time. I just he he already had one. Oh, hey you. What, why why are you wearing business casual, dude? Hey, I feel like I'm seeing a lot of you today. Or am I seeing you a lot? Or do I just feel that way? I got you maid gown. It's gonna look good, or is it gonna look? Bad. A full length maid gown. Oh neat. I gotta try this on pronto. I bet it makes me look dapper. I've always wanted to look dapper. Wow. You did not pull that off with the glasses and the hat, I'll be honest. What do you think? Not a stain or a smear. I wanna thank you. A baseball uniform. Not a stain or a smear. What? <laughs> Things can change pretty quickly, Sasha. Ne never, ne ooh, oh, Tiger Butterfly. Never, um, never count yourself out. Hey, yo, Jin, working on those legs. Yeah, I got you this baseball uniform, actually. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it, and you're gonna love me. Give me your photo. A baseball uniform, seriously, all right. I'm gonna look great flexing in this. Give me your photo. Thank you, this is definitely my style, Stubble. It's a striped tank. Okay. Give me a chore. Give me a chore and then give me your photo. Everybody seems to hate muscle soreness, but I actually don't mind it, Stubble. When my muscles are sore, I know my workout is getting results. It makes me happy, Stubble. Plus, it actually feels pretty good. Chore. Hey, yeah. Is it weight training time? Ch chore. I can't say I'm the biggest fan of your ruffled dress. I just don't think the cute look shows off my lats the way they deserve, Stubble. Well, I'm sorry that I look prettier than you, dick. Whatever, man. Island togetherness. Oh. That's cute. Try to talk to all your villagers every day. That's adorable. I could do that. I've talked to all my villagers for 50 days. That's that's awesome. Where the hell did he go? He's missing. He's gone. He walked off. He walked away. I wasn't done with you, man. Oh, well. I, I wasn't done with him. Hey, again. You keep checking up on me today, huh? Whatever, man. Procolo. I got you some soup. Don't complain. It's soup time. Eat it. That's soup. You eat it. Wait a second. Are you kidding me? A soup kettle? Thanks. I love this kind of stuff. But you knew that, didn't you? I did. I did know that. A dark parquette flooring. Get You can give flooring to me? I didn't know that. I thought they just gave you, like, clothing or furniture. Never just <laughs> wallpaper. You know what I can't wait for? I can't wait for beetle season. I see these little fuckers on the stumps, and I think, ooh, what if we were a beetle instead, though? That'd be awesome. What are we going to sing? Do it. Oh, hang on. The, the jukebox is off. Uh... Oh, the squeak words are going hard. Hang on, I want to listen to the squeak words and, and coach together. Let me just, uh... Turn it down a little bit. A little bit louder. I can't even hear the music. A little bit louder. Name something, go. Coach. Name something. Like, name something. Give, give something a name or just name anything. God, the squeak boys and coach go hard. Oh, they're squeaking so hard in sync. Coach, don't give up on this now. You asshole. Stop pretending to catch bugs. Shh. This is the make or break moment. Don't ruin it. Stop fucking pretending to catch bugs, asshole. Stop it. Name something? Coach. He's right there. If you want something instead of a person, uh, Squeakwood. 
Yo, what's up, Stubble? You know, my muscles are getting big enough to admit that my training hasn't been as effective lately. That's why I decided to turn the regular activities into a chance to pump, Stubble. Eden, for example, I tried to chew as fast as possible to target my face muscles. The only gain I got that from was an upset tummy and sore jaw. Back to the drawing board, I guess. Mid? You're right. Except for the squeakoids. The squeakoids are us here. I'd say Coach is kind of low, though. Coach isn't that good. He's not that cool. I like him, though. Although I do desperately want him to move out. I'm the main character here, not you, Coach. Let's see here. It's time to invite a camper. Let's invite Lucky. Lucky's mid. Yes, I'd like to invite Lucky, please. Thank you. Lucky! Oh my god! And ev eventually one day, Lucky will move in. Eventually. In the game section under $20, most games are $19.99. Yeah. That's under $20, dude. Hi. It's Lucky. What's up? Hi, by the way. I was so excited when I answered. I forgot if I said it. I know lots of ways to say hi. So, oh, he's doing this with again. How about tax? <laughs> How about tax? I live in Oregon, baby. There's no sales tax here. If something says 1999, it's 1999. That makes me so happy. I could never live anywhere that doesn't have sales tax or does have sales tax. Like, like uh, going up to Washington, for example. Like, if it, just going there on vacation, you go, you, you slip into like a convenience store, you buy like a Mountain Dew or something. It's like, oh, two dollars. Like, no, it's two dollars and like I don't know six cents or something like that. It's like, fucking stop it. Although I feel like tax would be a lot easier for me nowadays since I don't really pay in cash. I pay on like card and everything, but that's still annoying. To, like, have to pay more than you expected. That's still lame as hell. But, oh, I'm so glad I don't sales tax. It makes me... I, I was born into a world that doesn't have sales tax. And I'll never live in a world that has sales tax. That's everyone else's problem. I'm, I'm, I'm immune. I'm immune to your sales tax. You cannot sales tax me. Uh, assess these fossils, dude. I need, like, a single toe of a dinosaur. I'll be done. You got a sixty. You set, you got a sixty bucks game for five ninety nine. Too bad I can't afford it. Oh boy. I mean, sometimes you can if the cashier is cool. If you have sixty dollars, if you have like fifty nine dollars ninety nine cents on you, and you give him a sixty dollar game, he'll probably be like, "All right." You got sixty bucks for a five fifty nine ninety nine game. Can't afford it. Yeah, sales tax though, isn't it? I'm so glad. Imagine. Firefly squid. Or dynamic painting? Yeah, take this. Yeah, he already has the monthly painting, it turns out. The game was $63.96. That sucks. That sucks so hard. That's, that's a whole extra $4. That could, like... That could buy you... A Slurpee and two taquitos at seven, uh, three taquitos at 7 Eleven. And then you have like a dollar left over. <laughs> Booty hoo! This must be a firefly squid. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your firefly squid? Yes, please. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. Oh, Yingy's playing Animal Crossing. She's about to get my gifts. The firefly squid is a wee migratory squid that barely reaches three inches in length. That's cute. And though they live, usually live in deep water, they do venture to the coast to spawn. Like their firefly namesake, these sparkling squid emit a blue bioluminescent glow. This glow may be used to threaten enemies, communicate with friends, or perhaps to lure food in. Truth be told, we do not know why the firefly squid glows. We remain in the dark, as they say. Nice. 7-Eleven taquitos be hitting hard. They hit kind of. They hit, they hit quite nicely. But if you eat all three, it's a recipe for instant stomach disaster. You may eat two taquitos, but if you venture for a third, it will spell trouble for your bowels. And every time, I just, I just go for that third one. Every time. And then, and then like, a, a, like a minute after biting into the first one, it's like, oh, oh tummy hurty. I'm dying. I'm just hoping to see you today. Care for some coffee? Yes. Sure. 
That's just me. That's just me. Listen. They kill me. Sometimes you're you're hungry and you just get like five. I couldn't imagine eating five of those at the same time. That seems that feels like too many. That just feels like too much. The flavor is out of this world. It doesn't need a thing. I'll drink it just as brewed. Okay, he can't help but notice he didn't offer me any milkies. Well, if they're fresh, well, how do you know if they're fresh or not? I mean, if you just saw them slam them on the thing, maybe. I'm online. They're online. Oh, hey. Hello. What else is this? Catch a bagworm. Can I even catch a bagworm with all these fruit trees everywhere? I don't think I can. Redeem nook miles, catch a carp. Eh. I can do the underwater fish, but nothing else. Now, who should I invite? 7 Eleven is never fresh. 7 Eleven's fresh if you ask them to make it fresh. But you have to, like, go out of your way to ask. You have to be like, hey, can you pop this in the oven for me? And then they'll tell you yes, or they'll tell you no, fuck yourself. They might tell you no, fuck yourself. No, I, no, I, was, I was back in the 100s. Hang on, I just, got my, I, I just got my Bible in front of me here. Hang on. Oh, good. Yeah. It's, it's Flick's dear old daddy. <laughs> that requires speaking, true. Also requires the, uh, what's it called? The cashier to give a fuck. They'll usually do it during, during the day, though. If you come in at like 3 a.m. and ask for a fresh pizza and you only want like a little bit of it, I might not go for it. Oh, he brought... He brought Chip along. That's cute. Whoa. You haven't played Adventure Capitalist for... What the hell is Adventure Capitalist? Hello there! Thanks for again for the invite. I appreciate it. Thanks. What's up? Have you, met, have you ever met my dear boy Fleck? He's the most wonderful, passionate lad. I'm quite lucky. <laughs> there you go. I'm so grateful for my son, Chip. My son has Chip's boy to rely upon. My son has always been such a shy lad. He reminds me quite a little bit of me when I was his age. Some simulator game? You haven't you haven't played Adventure Capitalist for 1,128 hours. Why are you counting down the hours? Do you haven't played the game? Sometimes I wish I got to see more of my son, even if it's just for coffee. Alas, he's busy living his life. I miss him, but I also couldn't be any more proud of him. You loaded up the game and it told you? It tells you? Ugh. It's like when you load up Animal Crossing like seven years after you played it last and they're like, I haven't seen you in so long. We were all dying here without you. It's your fault. It's your fault. It makes me so it makes me feel so bad each and every time. Of all things, how did insects become such a touchy subject between my son and I? I simply don't understand it. We both adore the insect world. Ah, I'm sure the day will come when we can agree to disagree and put this minor unpleasantness behind us. Doesn't he eat bugs? Yeah, he eats bugs. Have you met my dear boy Flick? Oh yeah. You had a dialogue, huh? Yeah, unfortunate. Oh, wait. He said he admired how close Chip and his son was. Why, if I had an ant for every time I've prodded him for advice, I believe I'd have a corny. Corny. Okay, how about Chip? <laughs> this fucking guy. Every time I open an ant and watch me out somewhere, I'm there. So I'm here, Nick Nick. <laughs> oh, I love him. Chip has always been one of the better characters in this entire series. That kiddo and my kiddo almost seem like opposites, but maybe that's what I get along so well. Oh, <laughs> work for me in that nook. <laughs> two dads going up for coffee. Two day, two gay dads. Shoot, we should make, we should get our kids out here to join up for a cup of joe. Make for a whole breakfast out of it. Or pancakes, the whole deal. <laughs> that's super sweet. They're going to go to IHOP together. Sounds like Nat and his son can't agree on the care on the care treatment for bugs. I just think it's awful sweet that they both care so much. Eleven bugs sure does run the family. Nick. 
<laughs> He's so good. Mm, nothing like a hot cup of coffee after a particularly fishy breakfast, if you catch my drift. <laughs> <laughs> Do I catch a drift? I know that Nat is pretty protective of his son with him being a grown up. Well, with me all grown up on his own. Am I worried about CJ? Not a lick. He's probably worried about his old man, though. That's me. <laughs> He's so fucking good. What if I kick them out and I invite just Chip? <laughs> I wonder if there's a chance that they'll, like, fuck off. Like, uh, like if I invited Nat again, is there a chance that he would just come alone? You want to kill Chip? Why? The customer you want to contact is currently inside the Bruce. <sighs> Fine. Does anyone remember what my, my, what my Jack voice was? <laughs> you want to kill Chip? Thanks for coming to my, to my TED talk. I do not remember what my, uh, Jack sounded like. You're home now, Nico? Welcome home. There it is. I wonder if I can like go and look at my old clips, like my old, 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 old clips from like October or something. The ear. Content clips. I mean, I'm sure that they're. Oh, they're they're gonna be so old though. There's like balls. Julian's offer. We got some from like Stardew Valley, all the way from like Stardew Valley. Let's see here. It's the one where uh. It's it's the it's the one where uh, where 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 Quisp's character pisses behind the sign. Where'd that go? He peed super hard. Just as I was talking to Jack. But I guess maybe it's gone. Oh wait, this is a clips I've created. Nope, clips on my channel. There we go. There we go. Hang on. I'm doing all this work for a, stu a stupid voice that looks that sounds so bad. I wouldn't be doing Stardew, Stardew Valley. How how when when was Halloween? Halloween was pretty like late. That was around uh, December, right? Yeah, that was uh, that was around the time December happened, right? Maybe. Oh well. I'll just never find it. It's gone. It's gone. The clip's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. The voice is gone. I'll never know it again. Nope, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. I'll just die. I'll just die then. I have to come up with a new one for this guy? For this dickhead? It might... It might be in my folder somewhere. <laughs> Hang on. It it might be... It might be in my folder somewhere. Hang on. January. Maybe in January. Let's see here. The problem is I don't, I don't title these very well. Like, I got balls, choke, feet, gnome room. These don't describe anything. I don't think, I just don't think I have the clip. It's so sad. It's genuinely so sad. <laughs> but it's going to bother me if I don't do the same thing. Because I know I did something specific for it. I, I want to fall back on Joe. I always want to fall back on Joe. Like, Joe's a good fallback, but... Let me check my <laughs> fucking clips channel on my Discord. Maybe it's there. Maybe it's hanging out there somewhere. Or maybe it's not, and I'm an asshole still. Maybe it just didn't happen. Maybe Halloween never happened. If that's the case. Yep, that's, that's what happened. Halloween just didn't happen. Okay, well... Ho ho ho! It takes quite a lot of challenge. It takes quite a lot. Take a, it takes quite a lot of courage to call upon me, pumpkin. 
There we go. We finally got there eventually. Trick or treat or milk and sugar. It all depends on the date pumpkin. All that nonsense for just a stupid voice. So I find that milk and sugar are far more agreeable with coffee. Jack. Heard a rumor, pumpkin. Why does he call me pumpkin? I'm not your pet. That the sable cookies that Brewster bakes are ever so scrumptious. I would love to try some, but he says they're only for children. That just makes me want them more. Think you're going insane? Why, Aiden, Birdie? Sweet coffee may be dreadfully delightful, but I find candy itself to be the perfect coffee compliment. I could have sworn it was in, like, one of my highlight videos, also. Could have sworn it was in one of the highlights, also. Nope, 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 it's too late. You went to the kitchen, grabbed two slices of bread, and ate it on the toilet. Aiden Birdie. Do better. <laughs> that's, that's all I can say. Sweet and coffee may be dreadfully delightful, but I find candy itself to be the perfect coffee compliment. I, I read that. Treat yourself, pumpkin. Thick a lick of a lollipop and a sick of a bleak black drip. Weird worlds, weird worlds of flavor await. You going to sleep now, maybe? We'll help you have sweet dreams, maybe. Whether it's candy or coffee, a good little goblin never forgets to brush their teeth afterward. <laughs> a good little goblin. Hey, don't forget to brush your teeth. Be a good little goblin. <laughs> Don't forget to brush your teeth. I want to call Chip. I want to call Chip back and see if he has anything fun he'll say. Where would I put my Chip card? Oh, there it is. I want, to say if he, I want to see if he's got like anything cute he can say when he invites Flick over. Not Flick. Nat. Or does he bring his son instead? Oh, what if Chip brings his son instead? If he doesn't bring that along, it'll be so sad. Orange soda. I wish I had strawberry soda, but I don't. He brought his son along instead of Nat. Nat just took him out for coffee. And so what's he do? He turns around and hangs out with his son instead. Well, at least he's gonna have different dialogue. Oh, how are you the ones you called me? Well, glad to be here. Thanks. I'm so proud of my boy here, making a name for himself on the internet, and he looks so happy. And tears of joy, as I tell you, tears of joy. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot he's a streamer. I brought my son with me today. We look just like each other, don't worry. Here's a chip off of the old chip. I love this character. Wow, this coffee is great. I didn't know coffee could be this good. It's almost as good as instant. Almost as good as instant. My son told me all about this place. He says the community engagement with streamers is awesome. <laughs> me? Well, I'm just here to fish. <laughs> I'd think if I had to guess the mate, I'd say that my son and I both like fish in the same amount. What, what little difference? He's way better than I ever was. Can't even say I taught him everything he knows. That'd be a whopper of a fish tail. I love their relationship. What's CJ got to say about this? I like how he's just looking at his coffee, not even drinking it. Yeah! <laughs> Look with the tide brought in. Yuck, yuck. He laughs the same. <laughs> so, Flick and his old man don't see eye to eye in bugs. <laughs> I won't swim into the details, but it's kind of the right thing. It's kind of... It's the kind of thing where I think both can be right, you know? Nat likes to eat the bugs, and Flick wants to worship the bugs. Sometimes, families like rough seas, but even the worst patch of ocean calms down eventually. It's all good. Okay. I wish Flick and his dad got along as well as Flick and he does with bugs. But sometimes, kid family can just be like that. Cool. He's just, uh, he's, he's just talking about Flick. I should totally snag a selfie with my old man before we ship out. <laughs> he takes selfies with his dad. He takes selfies with his dad. What a good boy. My old man and I like to sail. My, my old man and I like to sail in here and talk about any fishing spots we found. We tried some good ones. All right, bye. That's cute. Next time I'll probably invite. Oh, next run of characters. In the two hundreds. Just put my Bible away. My big old Bible. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right. Did you encounter anything interesting on your walk home, Nico?
Any 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 cool hypothetical situations? Like, what if you were walking home and like you you you, you turned your head to like look at a look at a random bush that you always walk home when you you walk by when you walk home every day? Inside the little bush was like. A tiny, a tiny skinned little, little naked fetus looking man. And the second you look at him, he just screams at you like, "Yow!" He tries to scramble away. What'd you do? I, I love your walking home from, <laughs> your walking home from work hypotheticals. It's when you're most, it's when you're most vulnerable. But when you, you were going to work, you got jump scared by a dog and it made your tummy hurt. That's unfortunate. Jump scared by a dog, would it get, get you from a fence? Bong water's got it all. Nice folks, cool stuff, great snacks, and friendly bugs. I can stay here forever. Come back anytime. We're not, we're not kicking you out yet. Hey, give me a recipe, man. Wait, if you give him three gifts in a row, does he not give you recipes anymore? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. But you don't. You don't live here. Oh, so I wasted my time inviting Lucky is what I did. Well, that's cool. That's fine. I guess. I guess that's all right. I'll just have to remember that for next time. Which means I have to like start inviting someone else to the camp. Who else should I start inviting to the campsite? Man. These fucking flowers are so unruly. I should just repave this entire thing, make it like rock. Make it all rock. You're walking through the parking lot and was going through a narrow spot between two cars and a dog barked you from the right? Inside the car? Jump scared by a dog. Have I given everyone their gifts today? No, Tabby still needs to get like this antique, this antique table. Where the hell is Tabby hanging out at anyway? Where'd she fuck off to? She was just outside not too long ago. Oh, I got all these bones too. I gave Bracolo, Coach, Sasha, Marlo, Pietro, Lily. This needs Tabby. Even Shatter. I gave Shatter a toilet earlier. Alright, where's she hanging out at? Oh, hey. More fragments. I'll never turn down a nice fragment. Well, except for the times where you must turn away a fragment. Bye. Guess I'll go fuck myself. Cool. On it. Tabby didn't walk home, did she? It's is it just me or is it a bit a bit foggy out? Feels like it's a bit foggy out on my island today. It does. It's a little bit froggy. It's a little bit foggy. Oh, I could design Pietro a vacation house now, actually. That'd be cute. I haven't given him a gift today either. I want to sell. Oh. Sorry, they got a grandfather clock in here? Yeah, grandfather clock, dude. Oh, yeah, I was going to stick the rescue mannequin on the, uh, <laughs> on the, uh, the, the beach. Rainbow sweater. I'm gonna hold on to the rainbow sweater. I'll put that outside of Julian's house so I don't forget. Motherly statue. Will they take the real motherly statue? It's a real motherly statue. Looks like it's about to rain. It does look like it's about to rain. See, I like it when it rains in real life when I'm not working. Because it sounds nice and I, I get to look at it and not be in it. Will you take this? Oh, cock. Will you take this? It's a real motherly statue. Timmy. It's kind of priceless, though. Take this. A motherly statue. Sure, how about I offer you a thousand bells? Get fucked. Die. A thousand bells? Are you kidding me? This is a priceless artifact. Dude. Try to rim me dry. Motherly statue. A thousand bells. I dug that up out of the fucking dirt today, dude. 
Oh, you're right. It was about to rain. <laughs> yes. Now we get to listen to the rain versions of these songs. Oh, the rain versions are so good. You know, a peacock butterfly can apparently appear until 7 p.m. So I'm fine with those things. Wow, you just keep on turning up today. It's like you're only playing on a fence stubble. Now, Chin, I've been bored this cardio train. Oh, why am I dancing out during a bulking phase? What else can I do when I set these eyes on these beautifully toned eyes? Oh, fucking whatever, man. <laughs> That's not the new beach. He set a riddle at me, and I got confused and scared. Now, ooh, 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 star fragment. Uh, where would be a good place to put this? Um, probably like right here. That's good. I think that's good. What should you do if you see someone pass out on the beach? It's a nude beach. Don't worry about it. Oh, right. I was going to get the bridge. I was going to get a bridge going. That's right. I remember now. Hey, Annalise. Can I give you gifts yet? Well, should I suppose in the flowers soak up all this rain almost makes this weather worth it. I can give you gifts. Do I have anything I can give you? My goodness, I was so going for sleeping down at the beach. He's awake now. Try to keep up. I tried waking him, but he mumbled something about falafel and went back to sleep. That silly seagull, I confess, I'm a wee bit worried about, helping him about him napping in a place like that. Especially when it's raining, he can drown pretty easily. Um, I'll give you the antique council table, actually. I'll give Tabby whatever I see around. Here you go. This might look good in your house, maybe. Hopefully. An antique console table? Oh, there must be some kind of mistake. Is this really for me? It is. Oh, how do you know I've been wanting one of these? Thank you so much. Now, where should I put this for maximum impact? Maximum Genshin impact. Fishing vest. Nice. Nice. Her umbrella's cute. Is there anything cool in here? It's a cardboard box. Nice. What's gonna do? Bridge. That's right. Hey, you. Come here and give me that bridge. Ah, oh, Chin. This is the construction consultation counter. I would like to order a bridge. Bridge, please. Bridge please, Tom Nook. Stock infrastructure. Hmm. Let's talk about bridges. Nico, can you send me a maid dress? Can you send me a maid dress? I think it'd be a fun idea to like give that to Yingy. Cause she's probably streaming right now. Let me check. Cause I'd like to see that reaction on like a clip. Yeah, she absolutely is. That'd be fun. That'd be fun to go to their island and like give them that dress and be like, oh, here you go. Uh, suspension bridge, right? Those look good. Yeah. I like the suspension bridges a lot. I've been giving them a lot of frog posters, so I can't order my own. Maybe. I've been ordering a lot of frog posts and sending it to them so that, so that it counts for my letters. So I can't buy my own right now. I've also ordered a whole bunch of Hello Kitty stuff for myself earlier, so I cannot buy anything online. I could just change the day and do it March 4th, but yeah. I, I need money. I gotta pull out some cash. Should probably fix up this bridge at some point. Yeah, what if we made this bridge good again? 
You know, I could just replace all these wooden bridges with like stone bridges. That might look good. I mean, yeah, I think that's what I want to do actually. I should transition to a better bridges. Maybe brick bridges even. Maybe brick bridges. What do you think about what do you think about Bricolo? Man, the one day I don't play on Saturday, everybody's thinking. On Animal Crossing? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you thought I meant in real life. <laughs> Could you buy and send me a maid dress, IRL? <laughs> the one you already got me isn't good enough. The other day Chatter said said my catchphrase is boring. Well, don't listen to Chatter, he's a cuck anyway. What do you think about that? Is eat it boring? It is a bit boring. Can you help me make up a new one? I want I want less me, but um a smarter, cooler version of me. Um Um, 12, dead. Seventeen. Oh, I was going to say seventeen, seventeen injured. What should his new catchphrase be? I thought, huh? Come on, don't cheese. Tell me. Don't tease. I wanted to make it like 12 dead, 17 injured. Should I just make it yippy? I think making it yippy would just be good. Your current maid dress isn't good enough, TVH. It, it is a, like a cheapo Halloween maid dress, but like... Getting an actual good one would be expensive. But it's what we can provide for you. It's true. I think it's good enough. You know what? No E. Oh, I shouldn't have done the capital Y. Move this over here. What do you think? Let's try another one. Let me let me fix this. Slow this time. Let me let me let me do it without the the, the capital. You know what? How about the all caps? There we go. How many eyes are in the are in the Brocolo Yippie emote? Hang on. There's two eyes in the Brocolo Yippie emote. Okay, got it. Which I believe is a follower's emote, which means you can use that for free. There we go. Okay, let's try it out. Um Yippee! So what do you think? It's nice. Let's try it. Wow, it's perfect. Thanks. I'm gonna say it all the time. I mean, all the time. <laughs> oh, good. Whoa, what did Shadow get here? Oh, you little cuck. Are you chatting Annalise up? Okay, hang on. Let's talk. <laughs> so it's keeping you busy on the island lately, Annalise. Got any major goals? Oh, certainly. <laughs> Look at all the yippies on the stream. Oh, certainly. Let's see. Well, I'm in negotiation with, uh, negotiation with certain local entrepreneur about launching a new line of home decor. What? Wow, that really is boring. <laughs> it's like you're not even taking advantage of living on this island. Oh, well, thank you very much for the feedback. Please tell me more about how you shower in coconut milk and grow your, and grow your own palm trees, island boy. In other words, what do you do that's taking advantage of our lovely little paradise? Alright, how about this? I want this to be the year I finally copyright my laugh. <laughs> uh, there are three people on sound who have that laugh. Well, excuse me for ever doubting you. That sounds like such a noble and island specific venture. Is it possible to sprain one's eyeballs from rolling them too hard? The girls are fighting. Hola, Diego. Welcome. How's your night going? Ooh. Hang on, there's a gift around here. Welcome to uh, High Stardew Valley, which... Not, not Stardew Valley. Animal Crossing. I keep on doing that. Admittedly, not that high, actually. I did, I did chug the goo beforehand, but... 
I don't know. Usually Bull Dash shows up and makes me drink the rest of it. <laughs> so I'm having a pretty nice time. Yeah, I should probably go get this. All oh, right, I was going to turn into my bridge for another bridge. That's right. That's where I was at. I remember now. Should I go for the brick bridge or do I go for a different, better looking bridge? Because the brick bridge, uh, it's kind of... Uh, it's kind of... Uh, it's kind of not really... Not really good. No, wrong. Wrong place. Wrong place to be. Who's that? Who's online? Is that Nico? A b -b 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 big sippy from Nico? You got it, Broski. In fact, after this, I'm going to have to do a quick BRB with PS3 and the balls playing, because... Or I could just save that for later. You know what? Yeah. It'll be a while. Maybe. Ah, oh, shit. Hello, hello. Oh, I see you're cracking into your weed queue immediately after talking to me. Well, don't let me stop you. I'm running out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, hang on. Am I? It's hard to tell. It feels light. Which means I gotta get more. Oh, well. I love how long these things last, too. Like, it's 15 bucks for, like, one of those tiny little bottles there. And that just lasts an eternity. Like, at least a month. I think it might even, like, I think it might even last me two months. I'm staring at it, by the way. It might even last me two months. I haven't counted myself. Big sippy. Let me grab the bridge first, and then, oh, yucky. And then I'll grab... <laughs> I'll grab the bridge first and I'll do a BRB. Yucky. This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you? Um. Take this bridge back. Bridges. Look at the location. Looking for a location to install a new suspension bridge. Yes. How can I help? Let's not build it. Take back the unused extension bridge and let's do this again. The bri the suspension bridges it is kind of ugly. It's kind of ugly for where I have them. I think with the stone pavement, I might want to use a more modern looking bridge. The wooden one's pretty alright. The brick bridge I feel like will clash with the pink of the pavement that I have. The Zen bridges are a little bit too schmancy, like eh, kind of lame. The stone bridge is like a classic, though. The stone bridge is a, is a classic. But also, at the same time, it's so ugly. I think I could roll with a brick bridge. A little bit pricey, but that's okay. I got 25 million bells on me. A brick bridge! That's what you're sure about. Want we'll to proceed with this brick bridge? Yes. I mean, sure, I'll have to... Place some paths around. I'll have to place some paths after I put this bridge down, won't I? That's so sad. But hey, I guess it'll let me move over to the right side of my island and start, like, building that up a little bit. The right side of my island has nothing on it. Just a bunch of flowers of Peter Griffin. I should move someone's house over there. I should move Bricolo's house over there and then, like, move Flamingo. Move Bricolo's house over there. Uh, like over here to the right side of the island and then give coach and Sasha a little bit more room. What color should the maid dress be? Uh, black probably is the best color for a maid dress. You know, if you place structures too close to each other. Oh, it's talk it's talking shit about my house. Okay. I see how it is. Oh, yo, yo. To place a bridge, you need the wood. All right, I'll do this then. Start up the island designer. Start it up. We're doing this. Why do I need permission? Alright. There we go. How close can I get this to the house without, like, being that terrible? Oh, I see. I see how it is. Well, then I'll just do this one, too. How's that? How's that done? 
Hang on. There we go. Perfect. Let me imagine it. It doesn't come in black? It doesn't come in black. Who gave me my original maid dress in Animal Crossing? Because I've got a black one. You know what? It does come in black. I'll send you a black one. I'll send you two different maid dresses in the mail. Two black ones. I'll send this to you in the mail. That way I'll get... That's way I'll, that way I'll get letter points. Because I need to send more letters for letter points. And then you have the black ones in your uh, in your in your catalog. Where my dress is that? There we go. Here's one. Made dress. Move the pockets, and we also got the full length made dress for your made dress pleasure. There we go. Perfect. Doesn't come in black. What's well, gonna come in black? It's gonna. Oh, how is this? A mail from Yingy. Bingo Bongo Bong Water Town has all these wonderful froggies around. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit until sundown, smothered in froggies until you drown. Ribbit, ribbit. I love this so fucking much. Favorite? <laughs> That's awesome. What I get. Their town's name is Frussy Uwu, by the way. Yellow tulips. I mean, I don't mind having like a little bit of tulips next to my house. Don't wear them, stupid. Bury them. Oh, this isn't... <laughs> it's just two lips in a jar. You know what? I'll go get the silly. Lily. Show like that. The drift is so bad, even the X is going. What do you mean the X is going? You've seen the May just fly through the, the, the colors? Your, 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 your X on your Joy-Con is busted? Nico, have you considered sending your Joy-Cons in for repair yet? It's free and really easy. I've had my bad boys fixed at least four times now. Hmm, they have a card stand here. They do have a card stand here. Where to send a letter? Absolutely, baby. I'll send it to a friend. Nico. I'm not gonna write anything on the maid on the, on the letter. You don't, you don't need that. You don't need this from me. You don't need me like putting like a full autobiography into these letters. Now you can keep these. You can send them back. Do whatever you want. He sent me a video of it fucking up. All right, let me let me see that. Oh wow, that's kind of rad actually. Just seeing it stuck with all those colors like that. It's like uh, the the rainbow hair dye in Terraria. That lets you dye your armor and your hair and such, and it will just cycle through colors rapidly. That kicks ass. And I think that should be an actual outfit in this game. There should be an option to, like, get cursed by a witch. Or, like, that- Remember that, like, little chihuahua fairy dog that will, like, pop out of the fountain in the first game? Remember them? I think they should give you the ability to, uh... I don't know, just curse your clothes and, 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 and make them rainbow. Make them like shit. It'd be fucked up for the eyes, but that'd be cute. Alright, cool. Letter sent. Thanks for business. And now I will do a sweet, a freaking sweet, a freaking sweet BRB, Lois. Alright, be right back.
I'm back, Uwu. Uwu, I'm back. Oh well. Oh well. I hope you enjoy your um your black maid dresses. How'd you have every color of the maid dresses besides black though? Like how'd that even happen? All right, so I was gonna go put the go go grab uh, money from the ABD, put this frog put the put this flower on on Lily's table. There we go. Hmm. I should pop Mrs. Flamingo down somewhere. Should probably do that. Cause I, I'm keeping Mrs. Flamingo. I'm keeping her. Oh, I can also catch a tadpole and give it to Lily. Have I given Lily a gift today already? I have. I gave her a stool. Oh well. Should have thought about that. Oh well. I've got plenty of time to give her a tadpole. How much money did the uh did the bridge cost? I want to say it was like two hundred thousand bells. They pull out two fifty. I think it was expensive. I'll be honest, I forgot which bridge that I ordered. I took the most roundabout way to get to Lily's house ever. I took the worst way to get to Lily's house. Hello? Oh. Lily's not here. She's inside. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Perfect! Who do I hear squishing around here somewhere? That's Tabby. There she is. There's Tabby. What can I give you? Rainbow sweater, fishing vest. Mrs. Flamingo. I think she might do well with the with the rainbow sweater. Although she's a goth babe. Hmm. What do you give a, a, a your favorite goth? I'm gonna give her a black rose. I'm going to dig up one of my prized black roses and give it to her. She's worth it. She may not like it that much, but you know what? It'll look good in her house at least. Yeah, which one of these roses isn't doing so much work? Yeah, this one. This one's not really breeding or anything. I really just got to move these gyroids over by one. <laughs> if I just move them over by one, it will be so much easier for me. Tabby, you've eluded me for way too long. What's up? My feet are gonna get all wet today, aren't they? Meanwhile, I mean, that's a conversation starter. That's one way you can open a conversation. There were uh, so many other ways you could have also started the conversation, but, um, whatever. It's, I can't give her the flower. It's because it's a plant. Cancel. Bell! You tits got my hops up. Hey, yeah, that just made her depressed, didn't it? It absolutely made her so sad. Can you do something for me, me? Wow. That just like made her mood worsen, and now she hates me a lot, a lot more. Very suddenly. Ah, such pretty black roses. I use them to decorate. A poster for my first concert. Poster board, glitter glue, and these flowers. You're gonna re-put my flower that I just gave you? You're gonna tear- You're gonna tear apart my flower? Okay. I gave you that as a gift and you're just gonna rip it apart and use its petals. But what- Oh, God, fucking Lloyd is over there. I think I could pay this off from anywhere. Guess I was wrong. Do I really need this helmet on still? I will need this helmet on still for when it's not whole- Whole island. Oh, you're taking designations for a brick brick. Wow, I've got a lot more money than I thought I did. Sure, I'll help. I'll be the only one who helps. Do you think it's possible for someone to, like, never have to spend a single bell on the bridge? And just, like, wait as long as possible. How long would you have to wait for someone to complete the bridge? Just from citizen donations. Just from that alone. All uh, right. Should probably get to work on this. Uh, unfortunate as it is, I have, to, I have to get I have to get started. Which means this tree is going down. Most of the furniture is coming up. Those trees over there on the other side, those are also coming down. 
And I gotta dig up a whole bunch of flowers. Asshole. It's unfortunate, but it has to happen. I gotta clear out this entire space and whatever go to put an island over here. Which I think there should be there should be enough room for the island in there. Eventually. Cocksucker. That's fine. And then I'll move Marlo back over here at some point. It'd be good to have like an isolation island. Just for like nobody really goes to. Nobody's allowed to go to. Just to put the troublemakers in society. It can move my terrible nasty characters over there. Like, um, I don't have any nasty boys, but say if I had like Bianca or something, I can move them there. Sure, it's right next to my house, but eh, whatever. It's lower in the sales, like, property's value, but eh, it's fine. I'm not going to sell it anyway. So far, so good, though. I think, like, all this space from, like, from right here next to the birdhouse up to the bridge is perfect, though. That's going to be, like, the perfect amount of space for a house. I just need to clear up the size a little bit. Because I would still like this island to have some land on it. Like, besides the house. Eventually. Hopefully, Isabel doesn't complain about all the trees that I'm about to cut down. Because I don't really have a lot of room for more trees on this island. But I am going to have to come up with a new, like, thing to do on my island when I'm done with this whole island. The whole time I've been, I've been waiting for the nude beach to be completed, that's pretty much done. Or like the, uh, what's it called? Or the zen garden. Oh, that's not it. The rock garden. Well, those are both done now. Cock sucker. That's the opposite of what I wanted. But those are all done now. If I'm not like terraforming something on my island, I'm dying. If not, if I'm not building some sort of decoration here, I suffer. Which is why I'm not entirely too upset about Pietro wanting to move at some point. Cause sure, his island's all decorated and such, but I'll give you the chance to decorate it again. It'll be beautiful. It'll be cute. It'll be perfect. It'll make so much sense. You know, it's so strange. I just got the sudden urge to play Tower Unite again. And I really want to play Tower Unite. Couldn't tell you why. Just sudden, random urge to play Tower Unite. It's going to kill me. Maybe it's because I want to, like, go to an arcade and that game's got a nice arcade in it. You know... I think they've also recently added more arcade stuffs, which which kicks ass. I do enjoy I do really enjoy terraforming, but at the same time, when you're doing it for too long, it just it just becomes a slog, especially when you're like throwing down paths everywhere. Like, I don't want to have to go repath the entire island with, like, stone paths, but I'm gonna have to eventually so that my- so my town looks good. You know, you know, you know, oop, bonk the microphone. I should really add a violence command, so you can tally up how many times I've destroyed the microphone. Your new computer could run it good. Your new computer probably could run it pretty good. Oh, did somebody just- oh, yo, what's up? I've been trying to catch a crucian cup, but I haven't been able- but I haven't been able to yet. You're my rival, so I hate to ask. But would you catch a crucian cup for me? I'm on it. Yeah, I can do that. Thanks, Shin. I knew you'd be up for the challenge. Good luck, Stubble. Okay, don't let me forget that. Well, give me a, f a photograph for it, probably. Maybe. Maybe. If my good boy, he'll give me a photograph for it. You know, I had the thought for a second, like, I should probably go go find someone to replant all these flowers. I don't think that'll be necessary. I'll just sell the flowers. There's too many flowers in this island, as it is. If Isabel gets mad at me, 
I guess I'll plant more flowers, but I don't really don't want to. Hey, are you a Christian carp? How big is Christian carp? Coach needs this from me. If I don't do this for him, he, he'll get upset. He'll get upset and he might not give me his photograph. Come on. You cocksucker. Beefed it. Beefed! Oh, beef. Freaking beefed it, Moran. Nice job, loser. Okay. Oh, and I'm already got to sell these. Awesome. Gary, yeah, new computer could run Tyranet pretty good. Uh, how good could it run Tyranet before? Was it good or bad? Because I can imagine ball race being a lot more fun. If it's actually running at a speed that works. If it doesn't chug. Hey, boys. I'd like to sell you all these flowers. Look at all these flowers. Wow, we Wow, we have so many flowers. No, not the softwood. That's mine. I'm keeping it. For later. Ah, motherly statue. I really just gotta put that in my house. I really just gotta put that, put that away. You know what? Yeah, let me just go put the rainbow splitter outside of Julian's house. Put some of my garbage away so I can carry more flowers. I'm going to need to hold a lot of flowers. Look at flowers just sticking out of my pockets. Just hanging out. I'll stick this outside of Julian's house so I don't forget to give it to him. I meant to hand it to him earlier, but I gave him the retro sweater instead by accident like a fool, like a big asshole. I'll just, uh... There you go. Sure, sure. Oh, that's kind of ugly, actually. Rainbow sweater? No. I've got a better rainbow sweater at home. I'll keep this for myself, I guess. I guess. Oh, I'm, I'm glad I didn't give it to him, actually. Looks like a, 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 a dad's Christmas sweater. Look, he's trying to get the, car sh the crucian carp. Oh, another gift. Hello? From Nick. Oh, this is so hard. Oh my god. What, typing? Yeah, absolutely. It's 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 a giant pain in the dick. It's a maid dress. Sweet. I'll have to buy myself some more dr maid dresses off stream. Maybe. If someone were to redeem the in-game maid dress, what would I wear? Put in storage. Put in storage. Put in storage. What's great is you don't have to type anything out if you don't want to. If you just bite off of like the the Amazon Nook, you don't have to type a single thing. It comes pre-typed for you. All right, sweet. Now I'm gonna put Mr. F Mrs. Flamingo right here. Send this majoress off. What about else? Mrs. Flamingo. There she is. Man, I wish I remembered what I named the flamingo in Surrey Valley. Oh well. Is Bercolo thinking again? No, I thought he was having a thought, but he's just nervous to running. <laughs> I really shouldn't have been playing on so many Saturdays. There's so many thoughts happening. There's been at least three. At least three different ideas have happened on this island today. It's amazing. It's beautiful. Made dress. Now what should I write on the, on the letter? A friend. I will... Hmm. I got an idea. I'll, I'll do the, the, the clover one. I'll type, I'll type out like this. Uh, Frosty. Got me like and then return. Uh, where's the parentheses? There's one. I need an at symbol. I need an at symbol. There's no at symbols. Well, hang on. I can get myself an at symbol. 
Probably. It's in here somewhere. No, it's in, this, it's in the symbols category. All right, hang on. At symbol. At symbol. I can't do the at symbol. That's all I've ever wanted, though. Well, I have to find something else to use for the... Oh, here we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, hang on. Is this better? Yeah, it's better. Can I, th can I throw some little arms on there? I can. I can throw some little arms on there. Um. Let's put this in the middle here. All right. Return. Can I get like a uh, one of these triangles that point up? Where's that going to be hiding at? Is that going to be on the regular keyboard? I think it might be on the regular keyboard. One of them, one of them up arrows. Yeah, here we go. There's that. And just pop that in the center here. Return. Oh, nope. We 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 return. There we go. Awesome. Another parentheses. And uh, you know what? Let's just go back to the symbols real quick. I saw some good looking A's in here. Nope. Fuck off. Like, uh, these... Are these just regular A's, actually? I thought they were, like, a little bit thicker. No. Cool, that works for me. And then we'll go back to the regular symbol. And close off this little chat bubble. And this will be my letter to my friend Yingyi. Cool. I think that's good. Don't forget to attach the maid dress. Perfect. Beautiful. It's poetry. It reads like fucking the Bible. It's beautiful. It's That's my Odyssey. That's my Iliad. I'll never write anything better than that. Frusi, good to me like ah. <laughs> That's me yelling. <laughs> oh, who was that? Was it? It was. I think it was Shaquille O'Neal like tweeting about how um the hayride at some fucking I want to say a pumpkin farm was like poking into his ass, and he ended the tweet off with ah, and then in parentheses he says That's me yelling. That's me yelling. Ah, that's me yelling. All right, I was doing this. Oh, hey, you. You're going to be a Krushkin Karp. Krushki. Ooh. Krusty Karp. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Krushkin Karp. Krushi. Hey, coach. Guess what I got you. Whoa, just keep on turning it up today. It's like, it's like you're only playing a fence double. I caught a Krush Krushkin Karp for you. I know you were asking about this Krushkin Karp. Yeah, it's a Krushkin Karp. Yeah? Thanks, I got a trophy for your hard work. Okay, it's not a trophy, but take it anyway. It's a photograph of Coach. You helped me, so I'm helping you. Here, you can take my Coach's photo. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's just gonna go on. Lucky. <laughs> It's one of your favorite memes. It's one of my favorite memes, too. It's always in the back of my mind. Lucky, it's time to free to move in. Hey, Lucky. Lucky, baby. <laughs> wouldn't it Wouldn't it be surprising? But, ooh, somebody just offered to move out. Hey, Lucky. Camping food is all about s'mores, chocolate graham crackers, and a toasty marshmallow. Man, I wish I could eat s'mores at home. Too bad there's no way to toast to toasty a marshmallow without fire. Do you bet there's no way to toasty a marshmallow? Toasty! The folks on Bongwater made me a bunch of souvenirs. It made me so happy. When a neat island up with some real neat folks. I almost don't want to leave her, ouch. Why not move here, baby? Toasty! He's dead. What are you key smashing about, Nico? <laughs> Sorry for the wait. I went to talk about at resident services, folks. They said there was no more room to build property in this island. 
so I can't move here, but I could always ask another resident to swap with me. If that's cool with you, Rouch. Yeah. I mean, it's gonna be kind of rude for me to break up Julian and Coach's forbidden love, but at the same time, I don't want Coach in the island anymore. Jin scrammed to get the shotgun to put Coach <laughs> fucking down. <laughs> Coach, right? Yup. Okay, I'd be nervous, but I got no idea who they even are, so they can't make me nervous. Off I go. Take this gun, you might need it. Take this bear tranquilizer. I used all my courage and asked someone to change their whole life. For me, Lucky, a guy they don't even know. Oh, by the way, my name's Lucky. Hi. He hasn't introduced himself until now. Anyway, Coach said okay. He said he was already thinking about moving anyway because of all the night clowns. Night clowns? That's me. <laughs> That's me and Pietro. Also, listen to the fucking sound of the rain on the on the tent ceiling. That's beautiful. I love that. That's my favorite thing. I decided not to get into it. My point is I can move here now. Night clowns. Night clowns. I mean, yeah, that's just that's just me and, and Pietro. Although I haven't really done much night clowning on stream, have I? All the night clowning I've done was has been off streams ever since I caught like remember those those pier fish that were just the biggest pain in the cock to catch? Yeah, I haven't done any night clowning since then. Oh well. Oh well, night clown? Oh well, honk? Oh well, honk honk. Throws a custard pie at your face, squirts you with seltzer water. Hey, Jin, you can probably tell, but I'm moving out. I'm glad you stopped by, though. It just wouldn't feel right if we didn't compare biceps one last time. I'll never forget you or your amazing delt stubble. Alright, so I got coach in boxes. Starting bid is at one million bells. Or you can just come take him, I guess. <laughs> if you want him, come take him. But he's coach, so doubt it. I wonder if when he moves out, if he if someone else takes his this coach, if they'll take his house design also. That'd be interesting to find out. If when you adopt someone else's someone else's animal, if they uh, come with their like default house design or the one you designed for them, or the furniture you gifted them also. Coach's photo, baby. Coach's photo, baby. I'm so excited. I mean, like, sure, Lucky's not really that fun of a character, but hey, Coach is gone. Coach is gone. And finally, I have someone to give all my extra skeletons to. Are you fucking kidding me with this, with this fish? Finally, I have someone to give all my extra skeletons. You already got Coach? You can have two of them. You can have them combine into um, Coach 2. Coach Plus. Wow, a tire. Wow, a fucking tire! It's amazing. Cool. Love it. Alright, back to the terraforming nonsense. God, I'm so glad. All he asked for was a Christian carp, and that, 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 that's all it took to get his photo. Remember how for months I've been trying to get him off this island? Because off stream he gave me his, his photo. But I had to restart my switch because I fucked up and did something wrong. And then every single time since then, he just has refused to give me his photo. It finally happened. I'm so upset. Because that shouldn't have taken so long. Like, what were the odds? What were the odds? You know, this little area up here, like up in the corner, the top right. It's a little bit lacking. And for this supposed supposedly being like a town square area, it's 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 a little bit uh, it's a little bit bare. What do, what, do, what do you think I should like put around here? Besides like more trees and bushes. Like this, it's like a it's a little it's a little plaza. 
What do you usually have in a plaza? I should think like flower boxes. I should think about like what they have in Sturdy Valley or Harvest Moon. Okie dokie. Now how much of this do I actually want to be uh... To be hauled out. Probably not all of it up to the path, but probably most of it, right? I still would like a nice curve. This is not going to be the entire area hauled out. Probably just like... Might leave this as a bit of a walking space. Or don't. Or don't. Am I forced to keep this as it is? I am. I'm forced to keep that as it is. Alright, fuck myself. That's fine. There you go. I'll leave like a, a one tile long block to walk across. How's that? That'll be nice. That'll be nice to me. That's a mercy. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See? This will work out beautifully. Just gotta smooth this guy out a little bit. Or don't. Love that. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Beautiful. There's, there's definitely gonna be enough room for Whore Island, I think. There's no way there's not. In my old island, I did so much terraforming that I like practically didn't even resemble my old my what I started with in the first place. And it's a little bit sad. I'm kind of glad that I've mostly stuck around for most of the natural environment in this in this island. Most of it, not all of it. Like there were some really nasty, ugly mountains that just had to come down. This is this the best I can do. I can't like I don't know. Do this. I'll deal with that later after I've made the island itself. I'll pretty this area up later. For now, I just want to get as much river here as I can. And this thing's got to go. Alright, you're just moving. I'm putting this back somewhere. Oh, I was going to clean up a bit, my, but my pockets are full. Where can I put this Ferris wheel at? What up with this knowing as Ferris wheel? I mean, I could just move the, the wheel of cock. <laughs> yeah, how about I just scoot the wheel of cock over here? Yeah, there we go. Or I could even, like, put it next to the... The, the musical... The musical... The musical thing up here. This thing. Doot doot. It's, it's kind of all... It's kind of, like, sick nasty right there, though. I love having the strength to just tug on a giant ferris wheel and just drag it across the dirt. I am the strongest motherfucker there is. The guild will be done in 13 minutes? What do you mean the guild will be done in 13 minutes? What guild will be done in 13 minutes? What's that? Fuck's sake, hang on. I gotta put this down. Here's what I gotta do. I gotta like smooth this out a little bit. I gotta put like space for the ferris wheel right here. Tire Knight? Oh, it's, it's downloading? Why does it take so long to download? That is kind of nasty, actually. Just having like a cube there. You know what? This entire area just needs to be paved. Let's gonna pave it all. It's paved. It's getting paved. You're getting paved. All of it. So why does Tyre Knight take so long to download though? That's weird. Asshole. Why'd you do like a full 360 spin just to like whip that down? 
It's 17 gig. Why is it so much? It doesn't have all that much. It feels like it's, it wouldn't be like 17 gig game. Of course, I also don't know how much 17 gigs is. I guess you must have splurged for the all access pass, huh? Pietro Unlimited. Oh, yeah, I haven't given you a gift yet. So, what do you what do you do for self care these days, Chen? It's important, you know? Me? I just sleep. Pietro needs his beauty rest. The special on days when I'm training or boxing, or looking at stars, or exercise. So, I got carried away talking about myself. I guess that's what I do for my self care. Okay. Yeah, push it. I think now I put the first wheel down. Motherfucker. If I could just move his house like one step. Uh, if I could just move his house like one step to the right, I think I'd be happy. What do you mean there's no fucking room to put anything? Look at all this room to put everything. Man. God, jeez. I should, kick, I should kick out Pietro. I should kick him out. Just so he's not a problem anymore. I think if this tree came down, I could stick it there. Hang on, let me sell all these flowers first to have like pocket room. I gotta reorganize that whole area now. I just need to like take down the tree. Put the first wheel up there, so that way it wouldn't be in the way. It might be in the way, actually, when I try and, like, run past. Hmm. Hmm. Pissed. I could also just haul about the mountain a little bit, and give him, like, a little mountain carnival. That could be a thing. I don't, I don't really need that much mountain. Wait, when it comes down to it. I could just, like... Shear half it off. Just tear into it a little bit. Get myself some some Ferris wheel room. You know, you know. What's what's up there anyway? Flowers. <sighs> Who needs them? Yeah. What's 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 up on this cliff? Jack shit. That's what. A bunch of bunch of flowers. Yeah. I'll just I'll just dig into this a little bit. Let me. Get these out of here. I'm just gonna chop these trees down. Both of them. I don't know if I actually cut this far into it, but I want them gone. If Isabel complains that there's not enough trees on the on the island after this, I'll be so upset. But it's fine. I'll just plant some more fruits. She'll love it. I'll find some more places to stick them. Bottom right of my town, for example. Good place to put trees. Not a lot of anything going on there. This might also be one of the only places I'm actually growing tulips now that I think about it. Hmm. It'll look good. This place will finally make me happy. I'll, I'll, I'll like stick this uh this mini game like deep into in, into a hole in the cliff. Put the Ferris wheel somewhere else, I guess. And then there'll be more walking room when you come by here. It'll be sweet. It'll be nice. It'll be lovely. All this effort just for a whore island. But it has to be done. It's, 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 it's my current thought, so it has to be done. There we go. Yeah, that's power. You do feel sh so strong for tearing into a cliff. Don't mind me, Pietro. Just... Destroying the landscape around your home. You'll get used to it eventually. What do you mean, Pekang? What do you mean, Pekang? Alright, good. I thought I was about to tell me I couldn't dig where there were holes. Pekang! Good shit. Look all this room. Look, I've got so much room now all of a sudden. I'm just, I've just got, so, just got so much room all of a sudden. It's a miracle. Pekang! Yeah! I 
that's good. And I'll slam this in the corner over here. Right next to this balloons. Right here. I'll probably have to move it just so I can repave it, but that'll look good. And, um... How about... How about one of these? How about, like, I just, I just stick a hole in here also? Just for that, like, that little, that little carny game there. Yeah, perfect. I'll just jam this in the corner. And it will look good. And that way there's still, like, a little bit of cliff here to separate them. Oh, hang on. Can I make this, like, brown and ball-shaped? This, like, end bit? Or is that not allowed? Not allowed. Cool. It's fine. Didn't even care. Beautiful. And look, now this fits right here, the plaza stand game. Well, not right there, but... Right, right here? Awesome. And I can put this... Oh, actually, I can scoot... This over and put the balloon in there. Or, 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 or don't. That's fine, too. Can have the gnome in the corner also. The gnome belongs in the corner. There we go. How is that? Scooch this back. You can like pick this up. I could also move the popcorn and balloon the balloon thing back down here. balloon wagon that was like a little it's like a, it's like it's, it's sectioned off both with furniture and with cliff wonderful wonderful gorgeous I need a cotton candy maker somewhere oh whoa where'd it go it just vanished place yeah yeah cool what else do I have around here that can grab festival garland uh, where do I put my festival garlands at? But anyway, yeah, now it's time to chop down all this. That's almost complete. I'll pave it later. I'll pave it in a second. Because I want to take care of this for now. Man, that, that, that carnival sound is kind of, kind of the worst, isn't it? Is just genuinely the worst. See, we're going places. It's gonna be, it's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna be cute. It's gonna be gorgeous. It's gonna be wonderful. Asshole. No, I could... I could also, like, do this and have it, like... Curve up into this. But, that's kind of... That's kind of uggos, isn't it? Hang on, if I, like... Asshole. I can't even do that. That's, this is... That's kind of uggos. I like being able to step in the grass. Like, if you want to go fishing, you're going to have to step in the grass. You're going to have to get a little bit dirty. I'll fill this out a little bit more whenever I get the house in. Whenever the landmass is there, whenever the house is moved in, I'll, I'll fill this out and make it look cuter. Perfect. I gotta put pavement down. I gotta put down more pavement. It's so sad, but it has to happen. Specifically right around here. Just here, though. 
And whenever I get that bridge built, I'll, have, I'll probably have to like make more pavement to wrap around from the uh, from my house to over here. So there's like a, like a nice path people can follow. I think that'll look good. I think that'll look beautiful. I think that'll look cute and perfect. You know what? Actually, you know what? We don't need this clip either. If I just move this cliff, oh, cock. If I just move this cliff, I can have the path be like perfectly on sync with this, with the, with the, with, with this thing right here. Just gotta scooch it back a little bit. Beautiful. I'm sure, there's like a little bit of risk of you falling off the cliff and into a uh, carnival ride, but that's fine. Live with it. Can't you like design the back of a rock climbing wall actually? To look, um, to have some, some patterns on it? I could probably do that for my outdoor little, little festival I got here. Cocksucker? Turn this off. No, no more. <laughs> no more. I want to listen to the 5 p.m. song. No more of that. I could also probably like unpave some of this area because I don't really need all of it. Festival game for the Wii. Garden gnome also for the Wii. Yeah, I gotta put another one over here. Just one more. Talk sucker. I hear the balloon, but I don't want to go to my way for it. But I hear it. Oh, but it's right there. No, it's Pietro. <laughs> Thick. There's the present. There's the prezi. Where's that? I'll wait for it to get closer to me. Oh, he's fishing! Oh, I can't put it there. All right, asshole. All right, what do we got? Is it money? It's money. Nice. Can't even put that in my bank account right now, though. Cool. It was money all along. Grape soda. That's not grape. That's not grape. Where's the grape? Just like knuckles. I like grapes. Man. I'm just myself. There it is. It wasn't grape. Fuck. Grape? There it is. I only grabbed all my other sodas, even the empty one, before finding my grape. I don't have a lot of good flavors available right now. I wish I had strawberry soda, but I just don't. It's so sad, isn't it? Yeah, most is gonna is gonna have to get like chopped down and removed, I think. Like I don't need this sticking out here. That's okay though. That right there is fine. I don't need this bit hanging out. Cocksucker. Actually, fruit wheel. Let me get my wheel back out. Yeah, colorful wheel. That's the one. Where can I fit you? Can I just stick you right next to the balloon cart? No, I can't. Not allowed. Oh, Luigi. shit! You can see with a party of 15. Welcome! Frog raid. Here comes the frussies. Oh, the frussies. Welcome! I pick a choose you too, Turo Turo. Yingy. Catherine Eves. You've been here before, haven't you? Welcome! Hope you have a lovely night. I'm trying to fix my little fucking area here. Welcome, thank you for the letters. I'm glad you liked them. Did you like the maid dress that I found for you? I hope, I hope you got a clip of that because I want to see the reaction to it. Yeah, this is good for now. This, 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 this works for what it is. For now, at least. I'll fix it later, one day, maybe. Maybe. You put it on as a maid with the frog hat? With the frog hat, right? With the frog hat. Yeah, I'm, I have a mission to give you as many of those frog... Posts as, as I can. Do I only have one garland? Oh my god, I need to get another garland. 
I want to give you as many of those posters as I can. Just cause, hey, I got a good, I got a Nook Mile achievement to get. Also, welcome, Raiders. This is, uh, High Animal Crossing. I'm trying to get all these Nook Mile achievements while I'm high. <laughs> it's hard because I keep on forgetting what to do. But that's okay. Where's the, uh, where's the, uh, where's the, where's the, there it is. Popular pen pal. Yeah, 50 letters. Ugh. But thankfully, buying things online counts. Going to line the walls. Frog got. I frog. I frog gore. Scoot. I frog gore. You put them all up. There's gonna be like a lot of posters. Mm. Dude. Let me show you what I did with the flower that you gave me. By the way, right now I'm making like I'm, I'm trying to make a little island in the center of my island. Just for funsies. Cause, just cause I, I like to renovate. So I, pu I put the I put the flower you gave me right outside of Lily's house. Cause I figured she'd like that. We'll talk to Lily. We'll talk to Lily. It's a shame that uh, is the is Lily a follower emote? I think it is. Lily. Oh, she's working out. You always welcome to stop in when wax here, Toadie. What's up? You think that I use that kind of thing all the time, but no, not my stand at a bubble stand. Didn't I give that to her? I know it seems like there's a story here, but it's simple, Willy. Really. Sometimes I'm just a real comfort to have around, like a good friend, Toadie. That's cute. You need some like serious tunes inside your house. I should buy you a radio. I gotta, I gotta buy her a radio. Her house is sad, or I can redesign her house actually, through the whole happy home designer bullshit. Anyway, welcome to Bongwater. SMH? Why SMH? Why are you shaking your head? Why are you SMHing? Yeah. Poor Lily gets getting flamed. Flamed? How so? There we go. This'll be. In fact, I could even. I could even like make this even. That's right. This will be the site of Marlo's new home. Now that I've got this settled, I can center it and make it look good. Except I know at the same time that you can't center paths with someone's house. And it seems you can't center them with the bridge either. Cool. There we go. There we go. Gonna go soon? Not now, later? That's okay. Thanks for popping by. I appreciate it. Hope to see you again in the future. Oh yes, if you do the uh, hydration redemptions, uh, during these high streams, you can redeem a uh, die drink the bong water, which is an actual bong water. It's not actual bong water, don't worry. It's just the water with the weed goo that I use. That'll get me progressively higher throughout the stream. It's 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 like an edible, but it's a lot easier to, to take without it being such a, a just uh, like a, 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 a a nasty taste and bad smelling experience to get choked down like a dry cookie. I used to do that for Stardew Valley. I used to like have these, these admittedly really strong um, cookies that I would get from my family friend. But they were just, oh, they're so dry. So old. It's such a pain to eat them before the stream. It's a, this, is a, this is a giant pain in the cock. Hey, how wide does the house have to be? Like, probably that way, right? You could fit a house here. Pain the what? Pain the ass? Did I say pain the ass or cock? Because it was both a dick cramp and a pain in the ass. Cock? It, 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 was, it was bad. It was nasty. Tasted bad, too. That's because this, this weed water is much, 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 much easier to take down. Sure, it still tastes awful. But uh, hey, whatever. What can you do? What can you do about it? I just I just followed up with like a quick sick of a drink and then done. Donezo, easy peasy. I'm like sure it's not gonna be too isolated, but that's okay. There's someone living on like a little island like this feels nice. Even if it is a slight punishment. Like, if, if someone, like, moved your house to, like, an island, even if it was just 
slightly sectioned off from everyone else's houses, you feel a little bit like, okay, what's this supposed to mean? Is this like, um, you trying to communicate something to me or what? Why'd you move my house into the middle of a lake? Is that good? Is that even? That's as even as I'm going to get. I wonder if I could stick Marlo's house here. If this will fit. I could extend this by... I could extend it by two and put some fences there. I could. I could do that. Let me, let me go see if I can... Get Marlo's house to move over there. If it'll fit, it'll be it'll fit. If it won't fit, then there's more to do. It'll make the place look pretty. It's the Bong Water Beautification Act. It has to be done. Bong Waters look like a mess for too long. Oh, also, if you have if anybody here has like room on their islands, if you want coach, he's moving out. He's in boxes. Uh, let's talk homes. He's moving out. I don't. I doubt you want. You want him. He's got stubble on his face, but eh. Maybe you like Coach. Maybe you got a thing for Coach. Nine thousand bells. Okay, cool. Ready to brainstorm some ideas? Oh wait, wait, no. What are you talking about? This is not the moving. This is, this is remodeling the the inside of the house. Fuck. Uh, infrastructure. That's the one, right? Layout changes. That's the one. That's the one. Move a friends. Who's she talking to moving their home? I think it was Marlo. Although, Marlo. Although Marlo's house is kind of in a really good spot right now, admittedly. I do want to move Brocolo at some point. Maybe I can put Brocolo on Whore Island. I mean, he doesn't really live next to his sister anymore, so I guess I could do that. I'll just leave Marlo where he is, actually. I'll build a yard around him. He'll live there on the beach. And I'll move Brocolo into the center island. That'll work. That'll be perfect. And then he'll be close to me. Let's move a friend. Brocolo. This little freak. My favorite freak. Let's move him. Brocolo. Can you come here? Brocolo. There he is. I think that covers everything. So, Brocolo, do you want to move where Jen thinks you should move? Sure! <laughs> Scoot into a new place, doing new things, and maybe old things, all in a cool new spot. It's like, it's like 50 feet to the right. <laughs> Alright then, sounds good. Just leave the rest of me and our friend Shen. Cool. Hopefully it fits. If it doesn't fit, then... Guess I'll die. Lovely. Yeah, Marlo's new home is on the beach. I was gonna move him up there, but... Eh. This just works for me. This way I can give all my characters better yards. I think that'll be good for beautification. Like, like, with, with Bricolo's house gone, I can, like, bisect this area in half and give them both a huge section of lawn to live in. And sure, they barely go outside. That's okay. And they just got, like, a bunch of laundry clothes... clothes lines up. Eh, it's, it's fine. It'll look cute eventually. All right, so will this fit? It might. Hang on. Too close to water. Well, hang on. Let's talk about that again. Oh, that's perfect, actually. Should Bukola move here? Absolutely. Mm, let me imagine it. Oh, that's as good as it gets. That's wonderful. He's even got, like, room for, I don't know, a couple bushes. Pain in the what? Yeah, yeah. I could like smooth this out a little bit. Oh, smoothed. Get freaking smoothed, Moran. Son of a bitch. No. It's so unruly sometimes. Yeah, get smoothed. Dude. Ugh. In what world would I ever want that to happen? Okay, maybe I shouldn't smooth it out like this. Maybe that just looks bad. I mean, now it looks like a bullet. 
a little bit. Maybe should like widen it out by one. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of river there. I'll widen it out by one. Why would that be the thing that why would that be the thing that it thinks it wants me to do? I'll extend it by one. Make the island a little bit wider. More room for decorations. More room for fun! And more room for decorations. Yeah. No. And I can also fish here. I want to be able to reach the fish, you know? Although I, I will also be extending the... Uh, there he is up here. You won't be able to hop from this place over there. You can. Nope, I don't want that. I don't want you to be able to hop. Nope, none of this. Can I chop this down too? Yeah, none of that. No hopping. No hopping. This is your island. If you want to get to this island, you have to come down here. And get there yourself. No hopping. No cute little frog hops. Sure, the island design itself is kind of ugly. Ugh. But it's fine. I could still make it wider. I could still make it wider. With no... With no problems. Although... I want to extend that area. If you want to extend the, the other side of the island, the other side of the river, I should probably do that now first. You know, smooth these out a little bit, make them look better. Asshole. Just make these look a little bit better. Give me more walk walking room. But no room to hop onto the other island. There will be no hopping. this what's this little divot is that little divot cute I don't know I don't know it's a little bit mm, shoogy it's a little bit shoogy oh that looks kind of bad doesn't it why does it look like that but you can't hop over there so it's good enough for me Terraforming is the most painful thing you can do. But it's also so satisfying when it's all done. You think you never have to do it again. Good. Good. I like it. I like what I did here. I think he's good. He's perfectly sectioned off. He's got room for furniture and flowers and whatever else, whatever else he wants to own. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's cute. You get a birdhouse. You don't get a birdhouse. <laughs> Sorry? Birdhouse? Why would you think I want the birdhouse there? Of all places. I'll probably make some more wooden fences actually and like just throw them up. Maybe stick them in there. You can put like dividers here, right? That only take up like half a brick? Half a, half a tile? Or is that exclusively indoors? I think I did a great job. It may be ugly now, but it'll be beautiful later. It'll be beautiful fucking later. Right. So, I've... I can't build Coach at home. He's moving out. I was going to build Coach at home, but I can't do that. But I can build Pietro at home. Listen, Coach will have to be homeless for a little bit. That's okay. Coach can live. He'll be fine. He's he's hardy. Grab one. He'll be fine. I'll design him a house next time, probably next week. How's that? I'll give him a new house on the. I'll, I'll give him a vacation home. He'll love it. Coach's photo. Hang on, I'm putting this right up right now. And I really do like Coach, so he's gonna go like... 
in the blessed section. The blessed section, my favorite people. God. God, gorgeous. I'll give this off to Pietro, he'll, and he'll want to come to the island with me and make a vacation home. But first, I want to go to Cap'n. I haven't done Cap'n today. I gotta do Cap'n every day. At least most days. You get a recipe from him. I get Nook Miles from him. I don't think there was anything else that I'm missing out. Oh yeah, sea critters. Right, fuck. Ah, oh, I gotta get the sea critters. Can I stop constructing? Or, or save an end. Or say or or do that. That's fine. I didn't mean to. Say, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't mean to close the game. I'm mashing it as fast as I can. Can I get some fucking um? What's the weather channel from Pokemon Channel? That, that good, good waiting music where you fucked up and you know it. Where is it? Where'd it go? Pokemon channel weather. Living through this loading screen is so upset. It, it's, it's, it's so upset. Did they remove the fucking weather channel music off of YouTube? They did. They killed it. It's just a fucking... The only thing surviving of the Slowpoke Weather Channel on YouTube is the... Like, a screen recording of it. Like, someone, like, taking their cell phone and holding it up to their CRT TV to watch the Slowpoke Weather Channel with their partner, Pikachu. Well, whatever. We don't need that anymore. Game's done downloading. Welcome back! Tyree Knight? Oh, yeah. Since I... Since I closed the game and reopened it, I guess people have gone back into their houses. Some are outside now. Some are inside. Sasha! Or some have just not moved. Okay, Cap'n, for real this time. Actually, pockets? Pockets probably emptied first. Pockets, Captain, fishing for sea critters. And then, Pietro's house. And I think that wraps about everything up. Hey, hey boys. Hey boys. Hey boys. I got some flowers for you. I got some flowers for you. And remind me next time I play this to, to go talk to Isabel. Because she might not be happy with all the stuff that I picked up and moved. And all the trees that I cut down and flowers that I picked up and sold. She might be a little bit grumpy about that. She might be a little bit salty. Might even knock down the island to a four star rank and be like, there's not enough trees. You need, you, need, you need more trees. And that's gonna be a giant pain in the cock, isn't it? Hopefully, speaking of pain in the cock, tell me, speaking of dick cramps, hopefully fishing here isn't gonna be like the giant, the, <gasps> snail. Hopefully fishing here isn't gonna be the, the biggest pain in the dick around. Yes. Oh, I caught a snail. That makes me so happy. You, you, you don't even understand. I caught a fucking snail, dude. Uh, was, was there any more like star fragments around here? I forgot there was so star bits for me to grab. Maybe. I might have gotten them all. Might not have. Can't believe you have to sell like ten million seashells for, for an achievement. That's a lot of seashells to sell. It's like 10,000 seashells. Can't even kill- Ooh! Hey, what are you? You're a big man. You're a big man. What's a big man like you doing over here? You're not a sea bass, are you? No, we don't take too kindly of sea bass around these parts, but, um... If you're- if you're something different, kindly let me know. Aren't there, like, two big, big, rare fish that you can get from the pier year-round? not that, but that's year round, right? Oh, cool. All flounder. Cool. Are dabs still in this game? Yeah. Pissy's fragment. Oh, hey, you're still here. What are you doing hanging around for? 
think tomorrow I might also start up my soul silver nuzlocke maybe if I can get out of bed oh I do have like a dinner to go to tomorrow Ugh. well maybe if I can get home on time and have enough energy to I might start the soul silver nuzlocke tomorrow so I will need help nicknaming my men my men need to be nicknamed Oh, the frog. Well, it's unfortunate about the frog because he's getting skipped. And be impatient if you're always weird. It'd be a way to get before the island title comes into view. Oh. It, it just cuts him off so easily. So easily and quickly. Ooh, where are we? This place looks gorgeous. I need some of this. Because I think I used up all my vines last time I was here. Also, what did I just do? What did I just get? I used up all my vines last time I was here. Or last time I streamed the game. Gotta get more. Also, that's helpful because I didn't pick up my ladder this time. What kind of men do we got here? What kind of fellas are on this island? Please, boys. Please, boys! There we go. Anything cool? Anything rare? Eh. It counts towards my fishing total. It's nothing special. I did forget about these, though. I did forget there's rocks over here. Which means more stones for my, um, for my spike pit. Right, I still need to make a spike pit. I don't, I still don't think I have enough stones for it. But I'm hopeful. Hope for that one that will have the stones. Coconut. Consider the coconut. Eat the nut. I think I want to keep the snail. I think I want to like hold on to these snails and get like three snails. Now I'll go find Flick at some point. We'll make a snail like model. And it will look really beautiful and cute. It'll look gorgeous, it'll look lovely. It'd be wonderful. I can put it inside my house. I can put it in my stoner room. Oh, that'd be lovely, wouldn't it? I think I think that'd be the perfect thing to put to put in the corner of that room. It's just a nice snail. I could also put like the fish tank on like an actual pedestal. That'd be nice. It's a shame you can't get a fish tank like in Sturdy Valley that like you can put whatever fish you want into it. And they'll just learn to coexist with each other. That was quite a nice feature. And you can even put little hats on the urchins. Come on, how good is that? Oh! There's a guy! I fucked off. Great. The moment he touches the tree just becomes dust, he evaporates, vanishes. Gone. There's no weeds on this island, I just noticed. No weed. Usually these islands are covered in weed. I might even do some fishing around here. I've got the inventory space for it. Ugh. If I got the pocket space for it, I might do some diving. Oh, there's the gyroid. I realize I don't need the gyroids anymore, but they're still fun to get. Isn't there a another mission for finding gyroids? Or have I already gotten that? Let's see, a rough hewn. Gyroid getter. Yeah, I've already gotten enough gyroids. Oh well. Gyroid getter. Does that mean I've gotten every gyroids? What was that? Potato bug? No, it's another centipede. There he goes. He's going off the cliff. There he goes. Up oh, there, there he goes. He fell off. I was tempted to go catch him. I was really tempted to, but just couldn't bring myself to do it. Coconut. Don't plant the fucking. Hmm. 
I got Nook Mouse for growing a fruit tree. That's cool. Whatever. Well, I gotta catch fish and dive, so I mean, I might as well. Dive. I can dive. You win. Dive. Also, Nico, if you if you want to play Terry Knight after I'm streaming this, let me know, because I think I want to play Terry Knight. I, th I, th I think I do. So since this is a small island, there should be like a lot of bubbles showing up, right? Maybe? Oh, I don't think you can get scallops out here though, which is kind of lame. Although, what do I really need scallops for anymore anyway? I think I've already met past scallops as many times as I need to, right? It was a Chiba for meeting Pascal a bunch. Gulliver, Otter, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've already met him a bunch. I don't need him. He's probably give me as many pearls and recipes as he can give me. Probably. Come here, you. Come here, you. Come here, you. Come here, you. You can't get away from me, silly. You're just a shrimp. Shrimp play amazing. Shrimp check. You know, actually, you know what I just noticed? Last night when S had uh, mentioned the 24-7 shrimp channel. When she mentioned the 24-7 shrimp channel, the shrimp command didn't pop out. Why not? Also, why is my light pink? It should be defaulted to green right now. I've been in a green mood. Bring it back. Done? Yeah, good. Recently, I've been green. Also, what just happened? Did I fish? Oh, I, I, I fished up enough, I guess. I thought it was five, not three. Guess I was wrong. As usual. So sad. Still got room for fish, though. And there's plenty of fish here. I do love these Captain Islands. I just wish there was more for me to do here, typically. Can I even fit five fish in my pockets? I don't think I can. No. Oh well. I'll fit what I can fit in my pockets. And then I'll run away. Horse mackerel. I haven't seen a horse mackerel in forever. What season am I in? Ooh, can I catch that from here? I already, I already grabbed all the vines. I don't want to have to like put them back down to catch anything. Perfect. Am I in summer? I couldn't be. I haven't unlocked summer in this game yet. Yeah, look at it. Good shit. Oh, every time I fish, I just think about how... Oh, it's the same fish as at my town. Okay. Every time I fish... Actually, I can get the coelacanth right now, can't I? Coelacanth is all day when it's raining, isn't it? Every time I fish, I think about that one mission that's like, Oh, catch 100 fish in a row without fucking up at all. I think about it. I think about how it's already done. I get so happy. That it's just over. I never have to do it again. Unbelievably happy. I thought that was like a, like a, like a, bur a, a hurdle I would never jump over. Skip it. Skip it. Skip it. Skip it. He gets so mad. He gets so mad. He just gets so pissed. So when it's raining, there's an, ooh, there's a chance for a coelacanth at all times, right? I could take advantage of that, couldn't I? I could. But it'd have to be like a certain size though, right? My pockets are full anyway. Turn around, walk back. Did I get the message in a bottle while I was there? I didn't. Where was it? Did I? I think I did. Was there a message in a bottle? There should have been. I might have just not picked it up like an asshole. If there was, 
Oh, I can jump. I can jump from the other way, but not there. Uh, that's fine. That's cool. There you. That's cool. I love being able to jump from one way, but not the other. Loach. Loach. One more fish, and then I think I'll give Pietro the, the the good treatment. Go make his house. Just like a, a giant clown diarrhea house. I want to sell. I want to sell. Seashells? One day. Think about this for a second. One day. I won't ever have to sell a seashell anymore. Amazing to think about, right? Beautiful thoughts. Though I forgot to put this fucking ladder down while I was over there. Like an asshole. I've got so many excess bells. So when did the ATM get added to the game? Because I remember on my old island, I forgot what it was called, I think it was called Bumble Bay. I never had one of these. And it made everything a giant pain in the ass whenever I had a lot of money. And I go back and forth in town hall. These are new. They have to be new, right? They have to be. If they're not new, I'll be pissed. <laughs> ah, sneezies. Ah. Ah. Uh, I'm ruined. I'm broken. Ooh. Hey, big one. Thank you, Janny Banani. Well, welcome, by the way. You're not big enough to be a coelacanth, are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? No. Ah, oh, sneezies. No, that's a sea bass. I got excited for a second though. Like, what if? Is that all five fish already? But what if? But what if I want to see the canth by now? What if? But what if I want to see the canth? I've already gotten one, but like, what if? What if? I should go go and design what's his name's house though. Petro. Yeah, I should probably go be sweet to him. There's nothing else going on today, is there? I could go on a Nook Mile tour, but eh. Oh, fuck. Oh yeah, I was gonna put the ladder down. That's right. That's right. Just put this just put this right here. Wonderful. And I'll I'll stick all this stuff back in my storage later on. Maybe I can even, uh, use the storage off on the island. Pietro, we're gonna give you a home. Where'd you go? Where did that little clown man go? He couldn't have gone far. He's just a clown. He's just a, cl a clown. Where did he go? He's so fast. He, he's so fast. Oh my god. He was just there? Like, less than a minute ago. Um. Wow, he's just gone, isn't he? He's zip-zooming the hell out of here. Petro. Every moment that I don't find him, he's getting further away. He's walking off the island. He's in the sea. Piccolo. And at least his home. I just saw him. Where'd he go? He couldn't have like wandered into my my house, did he? No, that takes way too much precision to get in here. Of course he would go missing the moment I need him. He's not. No. Yeah, he would go missing the moment I want to be with him. Did he wander up here somewhere? Don't they usually only follow pla paths, typically? Plaths. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. I can't find him. He's not coming back. He's dead. He's dead for all I know. He slipped into the back rooms. Coach, P Pierre, Pierre's gone. Pietro. Not Pierre. Who's Pierre? Pierre's from Stardew Valley, stupid. Oh, he's actually dead. Who's Pietro? There never was a Pietro. What are you talking about? 
<laughs> Pietro, a clown sheep? You sound ridiculous. And they're all oh, the snail. They never existed. They were all there. He is. You got a second job as my personal paparazzo, Chen. <laughs> this is for you. It's a chocolates. It's just for you, baby. Do my nostrils detect the faint, sweet smell of souvenir chocolates? They do! Thank you, Hong Kong! Yeah, I bought these months ago. How's that job going, by the way? It sounds kind of glamorous, but is... But is it glamorous enough? I've got the perfect idea. Why don't you come with you? Say, now-ish, and I can check it out for myself. Great idea, Petro! That's why... That's what you're going to say, right? Or maybe Hong Kong? Let's go. <laughs> I'm full of great ideas. Let's go now. I'll give him a cute, like, clowny house. What to make his house, actually? What is one? I got a lot of stuff I can give him. I got the, all the festival gear. I got a bunch of, uh... Festival gear. I got some rainbow shenanigans. I got a lot for this funny sheep. A lot of things a handsome sheep can appreciate. I've got pies. I've got big silly shoes. I've got a unicycle, maybe? Yep, it never gets old no matter how many times I visit. Oh yeah, I, I, I remember I invited him here once by accident. Well, I'm gonna go enjoy the resort to the fullest. See you around. Bye. Yeah, hey Nico, what's up? Ever since I've completed the plot of this area, I haven't really been here much. It's okay. Maybe I could start coming back here more. But also, at the same time, eh, you know? Glowing moss. Oh, I already know this. Eh. Is there anyone around here back here who can give me, like, I don't know, stuff? I'm giving them a house? Bianca! Gross. Maybe not Bianca. Alright, oh, there's a clothing shop. I remember now. I think you can even get recipes from the people in the back of your restaurant. I should, probably should be should have been doing that more. I don't know if I have all the recipes yet though. Or not. I might. Boss might not. Welcome to Beach of an Earth. There's a lot of hats here. It's mostly hats, honestly. Aw, flower crown though. Yes, please. A light up flower crown? Fuck yeah, dude. Oh, what's this? That's cute. Do I have one of these already? It's like a little sun hat. Hand it to me. No, not that. I don't want that shit. Par but Paradise Plenty of Etsy? No, 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 no. I want this lovely hat. It's a display hat, isn't it? Oh, it's a display hat. Ugh. Okay. You can't actually buy it. It's a display hat. It's so fucking sad, dude. What else could you buy around here? Oh yeah, this thing in the corner. No. Lovely place, though. Lovely place, this beach of an earth. I think it's great. She really should be behind the counter, though. Honestly. But hey, whatever. Not my problem. Oh yeah, I was gonna get the recipe. Why are you just looking into the into the window, dude? Uh, I can't wait for today's festival. Ah, uh, I'm so excited. My body's dancing on its own. Oh, <laughs> help! I'm seeing flowers. Uh, I should. My vacation house is super neat. My bug friends love it. Ah, uh, just here to chat. Oh, I'm chatting. Okay. That's cute. They actually talk about the festival. They actually talk about the festival. When's the festival at? Is it every Wednesday? Or is it a some Wednesdays? Oh, hey guys. You are in the way. Oof. Why was, why was Mooma right in the way? Just standing there, bothering me. I wouldn't eat here. <laughs> uh, please don't tell my fans that I work here. I mean, I'm not embarrassed. I just don't want to be overrun with autograph seekers. <laughs> he was like, um, a toilet OnlyFans guy, right? 
Give me the recipe. What's in your mind? I forgot your voice, so we're just not gonna do this with you. Thanks. Plain scones. It's a scone, Luigi. You made it. I cooked it. <laughs> this is yummy, Luigi. Awesome. Wonder what kind of theme he wants, though. Pietro. Move, 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 move. You really shouldn't be standing there in the way like that. Like, that's genuinely just a bad move. If I could extend that, this entire restaurant just by like, a little bit, I'd make that walkway just a lot better. I wish you could like, choose where to put the entryway. In Happy Home Designer, didn't it have some unique houses that like, had like the entryway be in the corner, rather than in the center? Can you believe DJ KK himself will be performing here? The show starts at 6 p.m. So don't let me catch you working right up until the last minute. Okay. Don't let me catch you doing your fucking job, dude. Wouldn't want that to happen. Lottie, I'm looking for some work. Let's get me working. Good luck out there, baby. Alright, and on that note, I will have to do another BRB. Which is so sad. But it has to happen. There we go. We're, we're going back PS toward the balls for you because of how much you love it. There we go. This is the remix of a remix, by the way. Anyway, BRB. I'm back. You say you sent me a demon picture, Nico? Is that right? Hang on. You found a demon? Red Echidna Hot Dog Goblin Centaur. Oh, as like a... Like a character you can play as. That's pretty cool. I got a banana while I was out. I had the, had, had the munchies that only a, a banana could solve. You know how it is. You know how it is with bananas. I'll just be chomping on that for a little bit. I was sitting there like, did I eat anything today? And I was like, nah, not really. I should probably eat a banana. What's your problem? I want to share my world of dreams with everyone. A dream world, huh? 
There's nothing like a resort to make you feel like you're living your best life, Hong Kong. Let's go. The festival's starting soon, but there's no need to worry. I've got my dance routine memorized. Must be awesome to work at a resort, huh? Like you're working in paradise, living the dream. I've actually been thinking about getting my own place here, you know? Is that something you can help with? It is. Let's chat. Also, do you want some banana, Pietro? Let's go banana. Bellissimo. I'm sure you've got all this handled, so I don't have to do anything. But just in case, here's what I'm thinking. What does he want? Pietro's World of Dreams and their, cir their circus shit. That's very nice. I really like your concept. Well, it's his dreams. So, of course, he would dream about, like, festivals and shit. That just makes sense. I think... This is a good place for it, I think. Maybe. I don't know. What's a good place to, like, have a dream-like uh, carnival circus? Not really any of these places, right? Oh, there's a lot of shitty territory. <laughs> and Antonio and Ketchup. I don't know, probably like in the middle of like the city, right? That's what I'm thinking. That's good. It'll be it'll be a carnival outside and then like a little dreamland inside. Just one floor. Just one floor. You don't need you don't need to sleep anywhere. You sure have plenty of options. I'm not sure. One floor sounds tight and exclusive. Two floors sounds glamorous and inviting. I'll start with one floor. We'll switch it to two if I need two. If I feel the need for two, I'll do it. Yeah. Yeah, cool. I'm wondering what kind of furniture he wants from me, though. Like, is it going to let me do, like, a dream world or just, like, his little carnival that he wants? So this is going to be my, my vacation pad. I can't wait to see how you brand it. I'll leave it to you. I don't want to influence your vision, Hong Kong. Yeah, cool. It's those things. And then anything else that he wants is inside. Okay, well. So... He does want both. He wants all this carnival stuff, and then he wants to go inside and have, like, lava lamps and seashell tables and, and, and crazy flooring. Gesture stuff. Oh, look at all the cool gesture stuff. Well, let me just, uh, put on some other music. There we go. There, there, there we, there we, there we go. There we go, some nice designing tunes. Cool, first off, I want get, to get out of this. Plaza Wagon Balloon? What kind of colors can I make these? Ooh, cute! I could just make this entire thing cute if I wanted to. A bit loud, isn't it? Why are you so loud? Stop it! There we go. Oh, cute. Yeah, we can make it precious, or... Do I want it to be precious? It doesn't really- it kind of matches them, but also kind of doesn't, you know? You know what I mean? Put the balloon stand down here. It's like it's- it's kind of alright. Am I allowed to, like, pave this also? I am! I forgot about that. Alright, so what else does he want outside? Probably this will look good. This will look good. I mean, this is the, his, like, dream world after all, so why not? Why not have it be all cute? What color is this? What color can I make it? White, yellow, pink, purple. Let's go purple. Also, we don't want... What kind of... What kind of festival do you go to during the, the daytime? No, you want to do, like, 
the, the late, 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 late afternoon. Like, this is, like, this is where the vibes come in. This is the time of night where it starts getting, like, nice and vibey. Perfect, right? Yeah! Good shit. I'll get some floor lights out here later. Uh, gazebos. The shell arch won't really do any good here, honestly. It'd be kind of lame. Gate and port- oh yeah! The half an hour- the half hour looping gate and port video got fucking removed. Uh, is this even... I guess. There we go. This works for me. What do you want to put a fence? Do you just- do you want this like right in front of the stairs? Like right next to it? Right here? Or that too much? Maybe like... Oh, here's actually kind of perfect. Oh, it's beautiful. This will be this will be good. It's a, it's unfortunate though, because there's not a whole lot I can put out here, is there? I mean, there's a menu. I don't need a menu out here. Popcorn machine. That's good. Popcorn machine, good. Popcorn machine makes happy. Although you can't really see the popcorn machine. Oh well. I'll just- I'll just put another- another bench up there. How's that? Yeah, good. Yeah, good. Cool. Fountain? Absolute fountain. Oh, there's- there's not a lot of room for this fountain, is there? No. There really isn't. Kind of sad, but whatever. Can I change this to make it look good, like like a fairy tale castle? Ow, 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 ow. Hang on. Like a like a big old fairy tale castle. If we can make it fairy tale esque, that'd be lovely. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like I'm allowed to. Well, hang on. Red roof. Red roof? No red roof? There's no red roof. Okay. That's fine. Oh, it's fine. I didn't need a red roof anyway. I think so far this looks pretty good. Red wooden door, obviously. What do I want as the door plate? For this dream clown? Dream clown. It's all about the dream clowns, isn't it? Red. No. Blue? Maybe just not this. Maybe just not that at all. Maybe something else. It's a shame I can't, like, make a, a rainbow version of this. Mmm. Eh. Blue. That's pretty good. That's pretty alright. That's decent, I guess. I would like a better space to put this fountain. That's not allowed. It's like, no, only bad place to put the fountain allowed. Thank you. You'd have to like shit step around this, unfortunately. Maybe I could just make the house smaller. Maybe I don't need like I don't need like a big, huge, magnificent house. Yeah, just some just something small and cute will do the same. Yeah, th this right here. Perfect. That'll do the trick. It doesn't need to be like a giant grand magnificent house every single time. Beautiful. Beautiful, cute. Yes, room. Is there anything else that I want to have outside your house? How is the shell arch looking outside your house? How would this work for me? 
Oh, it really wouldn't. Oh, oh. Hey, you know what's criminal? You can't put benches underneath arches. Coco Bean, welcome. Hope you're having a lovely night. Welcome to uh, High Animal Crossing. I'm trying to do all the all the Nook Miles achievements while also being way stone for all these. Except I'm not really doing that right now. See, Pietro is moving out soon, maybe potentially. Um, so I'm giving him a, a new home, a new lease, a new lease on life, because I'm a good guy. What have you gotten up to today? Nope, that's not the right thing. I think um, I think I should pipe. Colorful wheel. I don't need the colorful wheel. I think I should probably just put down some pads and give up on the outdoors because this is as decent as it's gonna get. I think this is as good as it gets. I could even hey maybe I could uh, bring that on. Maybe I could put some fences up also. Terracotta tiles. There we go. What's better than this? It's terracotta tiles. Not much. Touch some grass. Watched anime. You went outside and watched anime? Un un unthought of. Unheard of. Nobody's ever done both. How did you do that and survive? Dude, that's crazy. What'd you watch? I'm always looking for new anime recommendations I'll never actually watch. But sometimes I do watch them. And that's what's really magical, is that sometimes it does happen. Sometimes, like um, like that one slime girl anime. It wasn't like a slime girl anime, it was um, I've been killing slimes for a thousand years and I'm max level, that one. I'm surprised I actually like sat down and watched that one. In the uh, what's it called? There was one where they got isekai into like a fantasy world and started running a, a business. Like a, like a restaurant. You don't know how you lived. I think this is pretty decent for what it is. You know what? No, I do need some more fl I do need some flowers. There's some outdoor stuff that is completely bonked the microphone. That's completely ignored. And stuff that I didn't even rec recommend to me. Hang on. I'm completely forgetting how to do this on my own. Now I have to like actually make decisions. Like Turkey Day. I'll find something to do with this. I'll find something to do with that. Yeah. <laughs> Using the recommended furniture exclusively. Nah, I'm better than that. Maybe. A romance type type of weed. You're a romance type of weed. Ah. Uh, I'm a I like seeing shit that hasn't really been done before. Like, um, there was this one where this girl got, like, she died at her job and, like, was transformed into, in, transported into this other world, like, and in, in, in sucked into, like, the body of a kid who had just died. And so she started trying to run a business as, like, a seven-year-old, and everyone was like, what the fuck? How do you know how to do tag? How do you know how to do math? <laughs> I was pretty entertained by that. Ooh, big ice cream. Obviously. Big ice cream. This is a fantasy world. It's a world of dreams. Why not add some mushrooms in here? Why not add some mushrooms in here? Mushrooms are cool. Mushrooms are good. Mushrooms are my friends. Hmm. Do I plenty of trees out here? Or does more big mushrooms. Can I even fit any more big mushrooms in here? Mush parasol. Can I actually like walk underneath the mush parasol? Uh. Let me, let me find out real quick. Can I walk under this? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I can't. Ugh, yucky. You're currently watching Tomodachi game, which is sort of like squid game, but a test of friendship. Tomodachi game. I don't know Tomodachi life. I don't know Tomodachi game. What is this Tomodachi game? And tell me more about it. Tomodachi game. How can a seven-year-old do math? I, I mean, I can do harder math, but I can barely spell. It's because she was like a 40-year-old woman. Sucked into the brain of a seven-year-old. Plus, also, it was like fantasy realm, so they're all peasants. Pe peasants. The peasants can't even do a read. 
Oh, hang on. The rescue mannequin has different colors. Oh, cool. Do you just lose the shorts? No, unfortunately. Unfortunate. So sad. Can I customize this? I can. I gotta add more. I gotta add more pads right here, I think. There we go. There we go. That's, that's good. I would like to, I would I would like to have some more here though, but I don't know what to pause the teacup ride. They didn't even suggest me the teacup ride on a merry-go-round. Are you kidding me? I really did not give myself enough space here. Having this giant fuck off cliff is not helping me in the slightest. I think I'll have to lose the fountain. I might have to lose the fountain. It's basically about five friends and they go through a series of games to test how strong their friendship bond is with thousands of deaths on the line. That sounds cute. Now I'd like to see that in Tomodachi life. That'd be, that'd, that'd kick ass. I'm thinking about... Think about just a natural ramp. Although white plank... White plank ramp. Kind of works for me. But yeah, this fountain might just be in the way no matter what I do. Hang on, here, here's what'll happen. I'll, I'll, I'll take this balloon thing, move it down here. And it's in the way. I didn't give myself enough room here. Do I keep the fountain, or do I go for another ride? Granted, I could also put the, the merry-go-round inside. But I still don't have room for a teacup ride. Maybe we don't need a teacup ride. Custom designs on ramps, the possibilities, if only. Oh, if only. I'd make that stairs the instant I could. Plus a clock, though, will work for me. Yo, plaza clock! Huge clock, dude! Clock huge! Awesome. I think... Hmm. Do I think? I don't. Nope, I don't think. Cotton candy stall! I could put the cotton candy stall inside... Festival stall. Ooh, rainbow. Yeah, the festival stall. Perfect. I'll put some garbage here. This is why you always look beyond your recommendations. You might find some cool shit. I'll put these inside. Hmm. I'm running out of room. I really want to put a lot of stuff out here, but I just don't have the room for it. It's so unfortunate. Yeah, so what they suggest they put right here? A uh, colorful juice? Maybe. That works for me. You know what? How about I how about I move this how about I move this like down here? I'll move I'll move the popcorns over here. This way that way it's like you come in, you you get some popcorn, you get yourself a drinky. And you hang. Nova light. Yeah, Nova light. Love a good rainbow. This rainbow slut loves a good rainbow. Perfect, beautiful, cute. Can I get some fog in here, actually? If I turn on the weather, can I make it like fall or, or foggy, or will, will, will like turn on rain? Oh. Well, I can get some fog here. That's about it. It's colorful, but not as colorful as I'd like. You see, if I could just make all these things like have LEDs on them that would just light them up, that'd be beautiful and cute, but unfortunate. Unfortunately, no. That's good. That's pretty good, I think. Hang on. I've only got a little bit of banana left. I might come back to this, I might not. Oh, cool.
All right. No more banana. All right, first off. Healing, so there's no more music in here. LED lights and Animal Crossing, if only. I think it'd be just, just be so much cuter if every item had like, not every item, but a lot of outdoor items had like a, uh, I don't know, a color option to slap some LEDs on them. You know, like a, like a parade float at Disneyland. Think like zoo lights. How they take all the buildings that are there at the zoo, and they just slap a bunch of like Christmas lights all over them so you can like see them. Like a theme park at night. Anyway, what kind of floors do you want? You wanted some real fucked up floors, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Perfect. Who's my favorite villager? I've got a thing for Poppy. I like Poppy a lot. Couldn't tell you why. I just like her a lot. Ooh. One of these two? A stage rug? Let's just make this like as big as it can. No, I don't think I'm a big fan of this remix. It sounds like it's just two songs playing over each other. That just sounds like two songs playing over each other. Ooh, party garlands. Alright, so there was some stuff I wanted to put in here. Namely, this, 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 um, the gazebo would be cute, rocket lamp. Hmm. Party guards, I'll deal with those in a second. I'll put these on the walls in a little bit. What else did I want to shove in here? I think I wanted to stick a Ferris wheel in here, yeah? Yeah. Boop, boop, that's the sound of the police. Welcome! That's not the sound of the police. That's the, that's the sound of getting booped on the nose, dude. Welcome, how's your night going? Heather the Badger. You selling anything tonight? I'm making a ooh, maybe one of these. Maybe a frozen drink machine. Oh, this it it is a it is a dream. It it is a nice it it's a dream after all. I might as well put an ice cream display out here. I'll recolor them in a second. Ice cream display. I was thinking about the slurpees, but eh. One of these can go in the center. Cotton candy machine. What else did I want in here? I reorganize everything in a second. But for now, happy birthday! No, I don't need the birthday sign. I do not need a festi festival garland. I don't need it. So you have so many life updates. It's only been like a week or two since, I, since I've seen you. What's happened? Not much has happened to me other than like I smoked my first dab, which was unfortunate for me. But, but I lived. I lived, which is fine. Uh, do I want this kind of floor? Eh, that one's kind of... Oh, that one's kind of... Eh, that one's kind of... Eh. Okay, dark wood works for me. Alright, cool. Put that in the corner. I have like a nice dessert corner over here. Where Pietro can just hang out and have his, his, his tasty desserts. Your landlord was a creep, so you moved out. And you, live now, you now live in your uncle's mansion, like in some estranged duchess. I'm sorry, yeah, your uncle has a mansion? And you only just now moved into it? What was stopping you from doing it like ages ago, man? I thought it was like an option this whole time. I don't know, I would have I would have chosen the uh, the Duchess route immediately. Like I wanna be a Duchess. I want to be a Duchess. Let me be a Duchess. Uh just a white moon would be fine, thank you. Good. Uh, I want a second one of these. There we go. Oh, hey. That looks good. So far. 
Your uncle has two kids and a dog. So, so it's a mansion and he's practically living there with just a handful of people and a dog? That must, there must be so much room. I'll put the festival stages down later if I have some room for them. Oh, hey. Festival float. I could put like a loud obnoxious float down if I want to. <laughs> Just a loud, obnoxious, annoying, the actual worst float. What other shelf furniture is there? Because I think putting a bunch of, um, iridescent shelf furniture would be perfect for this place. Hmm. What kind of lamp did I get from the mail the other day? It's like a soccer lamp. It wasn't this one, but it looked different. Similar. Oh, is this a balloon arch? Maybe I should go with the balloon arch. 2020 cel celebratory arch. Well, never mind then. They finally gave you, gave you the key to the gate, so you can, now you can just come and go. I think instead of coming or going, you should, like, stare creepily outside of your window. And then when someone notices you, you, like, you, like, disappear. And then you become a rumor. I think that's the route you should go. Oh, can I not customize that at all? Fuck myself? Oh, I can't customize that at all. Fuck myself. Okay. On it. I think... Hello. Cartoon, cartoon, summer resort. I think that's the route you should have gone. Personally. That's just me. <laughs> cartoon, cartoon, summer resort. Okay, yeah, sure. Let's see here. What else have we got around here? Uh, what's, what's a good vibe for this? Swan Lesson? I like Swan Lesson a lot. I really like Swan Lesson. There's a lot of room. People text each other instead of finding them to talk. Well, my family does that also. Because nobody wants to leave their rooms or get up out of their chairs. That's just something, that's just something we do. Rich people are insane. True. You didn't need to live in a mansion to know that. But I do live in a mansion. And you'll never leave, I imagine. Like, nobody's going to force you to leave. Cupcake. What is this? Mom's homemade cake? Oh, are you kidding me? Mom's homemade cake and have a kitty face on it? Why didn't I get the kitty face one? Oh! I want the kitty face cake! From my mom one. Mean mama! Give me the kitty face of cake! I need shelves. I need shelves in here. I need shelves in here. Let me get some shelves in here. Like some end tables, some shelves. Boxy stool. Hi, guys. Ooh, mushroom. Yes. That's a stool. That's not a table. Here we go. Lily pad table? Oh, they have the turkey day garden stand. I didn't, I didn't put anything outside the garden stand, did I? Well, this, work, this works for what he's going for. Spring blooming? Blooming. Yes. Yes. This works for me. I need more shelves, though. Like the, uh, like the big shelves. Not... Not the, uh, not, 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 not the Nordic shelves this time. The, the ones that are really tall. The ones that are good dividers. Where'd they go off to? Oh, hey. One of these, please. Gemini closet. Where are they? There they are. Damn, dude. Gemini closet made out of gold. Color can I make this? Just white, just white, or pink one. This room's a bit bare, isn't it? There's not much going on here, is there? Maybe it's because I've like got a giant Ferris wheel and a whole ass gazebo in here. That might be the case. That's 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 probably the issue, I think. But what else would you really want in here, honestly? 
Besides, like, I don't know. A few more knickknacks I could just stick on some shelves. Some clown gear on the walls. Look, I can't even see over there. It's awesome. How about this? Can I just, like, stick this in the corner over there? Have it fit nicely. I can have it fit almost nicely. Unfortunately. Ugh. Unfortunately, almost nice is not enough. I gotta put something in this corner. Something bug something good, something giant. Something. Something like this. White stone marble? Hey, you know, I never actually use these pillars. I've got this frozen one. This could work for me. Ice. Oh, that's. That's kind of small and terrible. That's all. It doesn't even reach up to the ceiling. <laughs> it doesn't even go all the way up. Oh. Oof. Uh. Okay. I see how it is. Fuck myself. Got it. Floor lights. Desperately need some floor lights. Without floor lights, I'm nothing. Light blue. Oh! Hey, let's do this instead. Let's turn the lights off. Yeah, let's just, like, shut these lights off and have some fun with this. Alright, I need to find as many lights that can hang from the ceiling and just put, like, everywhere as possible. Let me get that lamp. There was that lamp that I was looking at. There it is. Ooh, beautiful, cute. Iridescent? Even? Pearl? Is it- can I change the color of this and make the colors around it change? No, unfortunately. Pearl! That was kind of lame, actually. But, whatever. I need some, uh, some ceiling lights, I think. That's what needs to happen here. Oh, star clock. Oh, do that glows, though. Festival drum? Why not? Just have this in the corner somewhere. I think a nice rainbow festival drum will look... cute. You know? It'll just look, it'll just look adorable. Oh, actually, can I put this on the shelf here? I can. That's lovely. Hmm. What else would be good here? I could put on my clown shenanigans up a little bit. Mom's plushie. Whoa, Mom's plushie can come in so many different forms. Dot. Puppers. Yo. Peppa. Gertie. And Rory. These are awesome. Can you take these to Cyrus to get them customized? I like Bedford. <laughs> I really like Bedford. Oh, uh, Bedford. Bedford just has some, like, unmatched energy, you know? Doesn't get much better than Bedford. Confetti? Yeah, fuck it. Confetti cannons. Why not? Rainbow! Do I have to go over there and turn that on? I do. Yeah! Sounds bad. It makes a sound. If I could, like, mute it, that'd be good, but I can't, so I, so I won't. Wall mountain. Here we go. Here's my lights. Let's come over here and put some lights on your kitchen. Not even a kitchen, just like a snack bar. <laughs> um, wow, that barely- that barely lights up the area at all. That's cool. I need like a ceiling light for this. Hang on, I got this. I can make- I can make a ceiling light. I'll just, um... Do- do a cube light. Yeah, cube lights look cute. I guess. People like cube lights, right? Alright, let's... Wow, those barely illuminate anything. Those make almost no light. <laughs> those are awful! What does make a lot of light? Stained glass. Oh, there we go. It's a shame I can't customize the color of the stained glass, though. Or the... the color it emits. Purple. Oh. 
I think that's pretty alright. A little bit terrifying though. Maybe I should go for some of these hanging stage lights. Sure it looks a little bit less impressive. And sure it may not light up anything at all. You, you ever notice how lights sometimes just don't light things up? Can you light this up? A little bit. That's my favorite. Red! It's, it's, it's a fake light. It's a fake light. It's not even real light. Signaling light. There we go. That works for me. And it still <laughs> barely illuminates anything. Oh, I love lights that just barely work. Yes. Disco ball. There's not a single one good theme in here. And I think that's perfect for the for the dream. I think this place having like an inconsistent theme is just perfect for the whole dream idea. Although I do need more lights. I'll get some draperies in a bit. The milk glass was a pretty good light, right? Oh, it absolutely is. Oh, look at how good that milk glass is. Oh, it's milky. God shit. Can I put this in the center? Ooh, look at that. You can barely even tell that the milk glass is there. <laughs> it's giving clown core. Eh, it's not so much clown core as it is like. Eh, 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 bedtime core. <laughs> Sleepy core. Let me let me throw some stuff on the walls here. I got all this clown shit that I can throw up. Yeah, these these sick fits. Jester's shoes. This is his little outfit. His little outfit wall. Jester costume. And a jester hat, obviously. Obviously. That way, you too can play dress up. I'm gonna put these masks all over the walls. Oh, they don't just stick onto the walls like the leaf mask did? That's lame. That's weak. That one does. Okay, well, these are going up. Yeah, these these are going up. The, the full facial mask doesn't stay up on the wall. That's, that's lame as hell. Oh, hey, I've got a Venetian mask that I can put up. Hang on. The Venetian mask would look perfect in here. You gonna go to bed? Alright, have a lovely night. I think when I'm done de designing Pietro's house, I'll call it there, but I don't know how long that'll take. It could be a short while, it could be a long while. Decides, depends on how satisfied I am with all this by the end. Where's that Venetian mask at? There they are. Oh, God, why is it like that? Okay, I'll put down one Venetian mask. I'll put down one. I'll put the drum. I'll put... I'll put What's, what's his name? Bedregard? I'll put a single Venetian mask right here. Beautiful. Cute. Gorgeous. Love it. What else would he, does he want? You know it'd be cute in here? <laughs> Have I caught a, clown, a clownfish yet? Have I caught a clownfish yet? I would like to put a clownfish in here. Actually, do I still have the snail in my pocket? If I can, if I can release the snail into his yard, I would love that. Clownfish. Clownfish. I don't think I've caught a clownfish. No. No clownfish here. This is a clown free zone. Sweet shrimp. Sweet shrimp, dude. Maybe like a mantis shrimp would be good in here. I feel like he'd be a mantis shrimp appreciator. Thing on a pedestal. I should put that thing like inside of a shelf. But like actual like museum shelves, right? Yeah, I do. I've got ooh lighted display stand. Are you kidding me? Wow, that. Well, it lights up the the, the mantis. 
which is cool, actually. It actually lights up the mantis, that's kind of rad. Doesn't light up the rest of the tank, but whatever. It's okay, that's what running up to it and tapping is for. Like this. Boop! He punches the glass a little bit. What's not to love about this guy? Actually, I can even put this thing in here in the corner. Whoop. I should really just stick more lava lamps in the in, all around here. Oh, that's beautiful, actually. Yeah, I need more lighted LED displays. That's good. That's good. A b -b 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 big sippy from Boulder Dash. Welcome, by the way. How's it going? Wah. Wah. You're up late. Did you just wake up from a nap or something? A fat nap? A fatty nappy. Dude, Coach finally um, gave me his photograph, to which I immediately re replaced him with Lucky. Not so lucky now, huh? I'm trying to think about what else I can put in this godforsaken clown room. You've got a headache, you legit just can't feel better, it's making me sad. Um, hmm. How can I help you? Let me think. Have you taken a lot of medicine? Like a lot of it, like probably more than you should. Have you taken a shower? Have you drank your water? You can't, I can't help you. That's so sad. Oh, here we go. Gumball machines. I think a gumball machine or two would be just fine in here. Just swell, just dandy. How about like a, Okay, how about like a gotcha machine also? Yeah, how about that? I think a gotcha machine is perfect. Convenient that you can watch your pop-up just in time for gotcha machines. How about like a second gotcha machine? That's blue in color. Maybe a little tingle laugh? You want a little bit of tingle laugh? Hang on, let me talk to Pietro. He, he's the- he's just the same voice, so it works out. <laughs> Wait, is the vacation home done already? How is that possible? Not yet. No problemo! Take your time and make it perfect, okay? <laughs> cool little impa. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh -ho. What else can I put in this shitty clown's house? I love him. But I think his- I think his house is done. Despite being awful, I think it's done. Rainbow. I think I just gotta put some more lights up on the ceiling. More lights, probably some more rugs. <laughs> that helps a little. I'm glad, even though- even though I feel like that would just hurt a headache more than anything. I guess it works out. Ew. Look at this guy. No, not you. Yeah, cool. It looks like a giant bath towel. That's what I used to use as bath towels in Happy Home Designer. Back when they let you choose like the same rug, the, the same exact rug, as a small, medium, or large size. Remember that? Remember that whole thing? What happened to that? Hmm. I just need some more lights in here. Just some more lights. A drapery would be nice. Yeah, this guy. Yeah, just, just a nice little drapery to, to section off the uh, the main room, room from the rest. I'll even put this disco ball over here. Good. Is there a way for me to turn off the Ferris wheel music? Give him butthole rug? I don't want to give him the butthole rug. <laughs> I don't like the butthole rug. Dreamy hanging decoration? Alright. I can work with this. <laughs> yeah. That's good.
Enamel lamp. What's the enamel lamp look like? Is the enamel lamp going to be good? Enamel lamp. Is it going to be good? Or... That's... It's all right. I guess. I guess? Yeah, I guess. I thought if he was laying down in the bed, it would like be shining right down exclusively on his dick. Balls and cock and balls and shaft. And dick. But whatever. Ooh, actually. This chandelier that you gave me could actually be perfect in here. How much light does it give off? It gives off a decent amount of light. It's pretty decent. Hang on. Okay, it gives off a decent amount of light for the things around it. So, it'd be good over here. Except not really. Because for some reason, it, wants, it doesn't want to light up the masks. It wants to light up everything but the masks. And what if this was inside of the Ferris wheel instead of the milk lamp? Would that look cool? Or look... Okay, that's kind of sick. That's kind of that's kind of snifty. Is that mantis lamp? Is that mantis shrimp's light on? Hang on, let me go. Let me get over there. Let me check. Yeah, its light is on. Hang on. So, is its light on? It turned on again. What's going on with this lamp? With this with this mantis shrimp? Okay, he's on. Now he's turned off. Now he's still turned off, but now he's on again. Turned. I'll just put another milk lamp over him. How's that sound? How's that sound? I think that sounds pretty good. Yeah, milk lamp. Why'd you call it a Ferris wheel? Because it. Oh, I was thinking about the Ferris wheel outside. I've always gotten Ferris wheels and merry-go-rounds confused like my entire life also because I'm a dumb idiot asshole, baby. I know what they are, but I don't- like I always mix the two up. Like a fool. Alright. There's some more wall decor I could put up. They suggested me some banners? Sure this place is gonna look like a giant like filthy fucking mess by the end of it, but eh. Whatever. It's a dream. That just comes with the dream territory. Good. Put some stars up. Actually. Oh, can I put some stars up over here too? Try to move those down. Ooh, I may. Fantastic. Who doesn't love who doesn't love a Starland? Don't need a light on the disco ball? Maybe later. But I feel like putting a light on the disco ball. How's that sound? Oh. The disco ball doesn't have any function in the game actually, which is super upsetting. On un shrimp. Wah. But I wish it did. I wish I had ooh, I wish I had a function. But it doesn't. It just looks pretty. But I could put out a light on it anyway, see if it does anything at all. Uh -huh. Love that. Can I, just, can I just like copy all these and just drag them over? I can. I can and I will. Except they reverse. And I can't actually because there's something in the way here. What is in the way there? What is in the way? Oh, it's the fucking clown gear. That's what's in the way. Well, you know, these have to move over here. Green will go in this corner. There's, they're swapped around in the weird, in a weird way. Purple is perfect. Pink, right here. Orange. Cool. Oh, okay. This is what it sounds like when a child dies. 
Oh yeah, I can. Oh, and I can put up more of these guys also. Perfect. Oh, beautiful. This look cute. This look cute as hell. Um, there we go. I'm about to say, motherfucker, you will fit. Good. Good shit. And sure, it looks a little bit, uh, uh, clown diary-esque, but that's, that's just part for the course. This is pretty alright. This lighting, a lot better. This lighting is a lot better than, like, having the light off, actually. It's supposed to be a dream, and it's supposed to be a clown. You're gonna get some clown diary in there. A little bit of lights, alright? What do you think about this? Just needs a ball hole rug? I don't know about you, but my dreams don't have ball hole rugs in them. Maybe we're just built different? You're right, though. Let me see if I can, like, jam a butthole rug in here somewhere. You know what I could do? That'd be really mean. You know what I could do? Hang on, watch this. Hang on. You know what I could do? You don't get the butthole. <laughs> oh, and that looks like a froggy rug, actually, which is kind of adorable. It's a little bit, it's a little bit frogular. Or, alternatively, only butthole. That gives me an idea. Right there. Oh no, the butthole is there. Oh, hang on, let me look at this fl flipped around. I think that's kind of cute, actually. It looks a lot better when the butthole is hanging out. Grab it. It's kind of cute, but it's a lot better than like the big bath towel that I had there, pri pri previously. Previously. Magic circle rug? Eh, who needs that? Now, I could give him a second floor, but I won't. Because I think this is a lot better. Although, he does need a radio in here. What do you think? Definite, definite need of a radio. Look, he's even got room for one. He's absolutely got room for a radio. This is a small one. A small little radio for him to, like, listen to, I don't know, Gus the Ghostbusters theme out of? Yeah. The Ghostbusters. Cherry speakers. Ooh, here we go. Shell speaker. Put the stage thing in the middle. This is the song he listens to. The gay one. Oh right, from the Peacock. You're right. I, I, I did mention how I was gonna like put some of the stages in here. I just didn't. There it is. I could put several stages out here. I felt like it. I could make them multiple colors too. What colors do I have available? Pink, blue, red, green. I'll put these in pink and blue. I'll just, um,. I'll put a rainbow one here. I could also make another froggy rug. Kind of make another froggy rug, I'll be honest. I think it's I think it's gorgeous. I think it's beautiful and cute. It's a clusterfuck. It's an absolute cl clusterfuck, but you can walk everywhere. It is functional. It's a bed. It's a bedroom. It's it's got a wardrobe. It's got it's got a pet. It's got your clothing. 
got music. It's got it's even got like a kitchen so you can eat. Sure, it may just be ice cream and cotton candy, but I mean, that's what clowns eat. You got all the necessary di all the dietary um necessities of a clown. Also, actually, if I moved these down here, swanked these to the side, and then and then sloppy these two, I can even have the rest of the colors. Oh, hang on. I, gotta, I just got to swing this over here. There we go. Although the red and the green ones look kind of dumpy. They're kind of dumpy. That's fine. That's fine. Hang on. I can even like copy, copy this rug and put it on the other side. Oh. <laughs> That's pretty good. How about this look on in the kitchen? Bad? Bad. Maybe I don't want it symmetrical. Maybe I don't want these here at all. Hmm? It's a shame you can't put the floor lights underneath anything, like genuinely. Butt plug, yeah. I don't know, I think I dig it. It's just a shame it's not like, uh, Happy Home fucking, what's it called, on the, on the on your iPhone. The campground game, where they could actually, like, interact with your Ferris wheels and your merry-go-rounds and such. Doesn't look that bad? Well, I'm glad you think so. The outside's pretty okay, too. It's like, he... There's not a lot of clown gear in this game, unfortunately. The best you get is the fairy tale stuff. And the carnival gear, but it's hard to combine the two themes when there's not a lot to be given. I mean, like, it looks okay. There's not much going on out here. Could probably throw some flowers down here. That's about it. I'd probably throw some flowers out here, I guess. Like, um, wind flowers. Perfect. Perfect. Good shit. Right, let's go back inside, Pietro. Here's your home. Yeah, Pietro gave me his photo today, so whenever he wants to move away, I'll let him. And, uh, I'm not gonna force him out because I love him, and then there's an the emote of him. But, uh, Coach gave me his photograph also, and I kicked out Lucky. Wait, is the vacation home done already? How is that possible? Let's not add an upstairs. I really don't want to give you an upstairs. You don't deserve it. Yes! I'm waiting for this moment, honk honk. You're really putting a lot of thought into this project, huh? That's a T-H-O team. I'm so lucky to have you on my design team. Yeah. Yeah, cock. I didn't take a picture with him. Hopefully he takes a good one himself. I'm ready. Oh, that's pretty alright. That's pretty nice already. Oh, I should be pressing plus, shouldn't I? Look, he's using the gazebo. He's using the gazebo like he should. He loves it. Perfect. That's good, though. That camera angle with all that fog, that's fantastic, actually. With all those colorful lights beaming up. That's pretty good. If only I could have gotten more colorful lights. Like, off the ceiling. He has no choice but to love it. I mean, it's a vacation house. This was everything, Hong Kong. Thanks again. Oh, hey. What are your plans later, anyway? Taking long naps or anything fun? Uh, I'll be heading back, actually. Gotcha, gotcha. No problem. I'll stop by any time, Hong Kong. This is vacation home. He does have a choice. He's got he's got a choice because he's got two homes. Coach, however, is about to have no homes. No homes. He's gonna be ha 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 homeless. Welcome back, Chen. You've earned 15,000 pokey. Finished for today? Or will you work a little longer? I'm finished. But I do want to buy some more stuff from Wardell. Because I'm pretty sure there was more gear that I wanted inside my house. There was, like, there was some more, um... Stuff. Can I order something? 
There were, there was some more stuff that I wanted to make for a house. Let's see here. I wanted wall-mounted neon lamps, a frozen drink machine, a high-end stereo, and a rocker lamp. I think I wanted the stereo for the stoter room, but I don't think that's going to be necessary. Got the rocket lamps. Maybe I wanted another rocket lamp? How thick is the frozen drink machine? Because this can go in the corner in, in my stoner room if I want it. How thick is it? Looks like it's one thick. Ooh, cute. Natural, cool. Let's go with cool. That's just gonna go go in the corner. That's all I've wanted. Thank you. Actually, you know what? Thank you. I want the uh, I want the blue froggy chair so I can give it to Lily. There's a light blue froggy chair and I want it. Do you think they only brought back the froggy chair because of the public outcry? Or do you think they had plans to bring back the froggy chair the whole time? You're gonna die now? You're gonna die? What do you mean you're gonna die now? Where are you gonna die? Boulderash? Did I give you another 13th reason by accident? What, what happened there? Light up flower crown. Kick ass. What happened, lad? Yeah, my recipes. Oh, cool. Scones. It's a scone, Luigi. Time to go sleepy. I think it's time for all of us to go sleepy, except for me. I'm, it's time for me to go eat a cheeseburger out of my fridge that has jalapenos in it. Oh, jalape jalapeno cheeseburger. Let's see if there's anyone online that I could give some love and attention to. Mm, boop. That's the end of the stream, by the way. Let's see here. Um, Amber Jesse's online playing Overwatch. You know how much I love okay. to read Amber Jesse. Ah, that's her. Cat. That's her. <laughs> You know how much I love to raid, raid Amber Dusty at the end of these streams. She's the only one online ever. Oh, there's no music playing, is there? There we go. Alright. Thank you all for coming by and hanging out tonight. If you join on this raid, you will get some chocolate coins. Saving it for maid dresses, bunny ears. Hey. Could be worth it. Want to thank you for coming by. And I hope you have a lovely night or day. Depending on what, whatever time zone is. Don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. I might do Soul Silver. Maybe. Maybe. Don't know if I'll be able to wake up in time. But anyway, bye bye.